Diablo 4, my friends. It is finally here. We can finally play the game, which I'm super excited for, of course. Let me just move this out of the way. Boom, there we go. Now we get to select our character. I need a tactical decision. We're playing 12 hours after the game has actually launched because I knew that every AAA studio ever that's released a game won't possibly let you log in at the same time as everyone else to play the game. So I thought, well, I'll just go to bed and wake up and then I'll do a live stream with you guys and we can play the game when everyone's asleep because I live in England. So here we are in character selection, no problems logging in, no issues at all. I guess they solved that while I was sleeping, which is why I had that tactical decision, my friends. But here we are in Diablo 4, about to get started. I'm pretty damn excited. I finally decided on a class, but we're going to go through like kind of like just a rough impressions of what I, I got out of each one in the beta. So you got the Barbarian. Really love the aesthetic of this class. You can make really fun bleed builds where the enemies attack you and just die. Uh, currently the most powerful tier 1 build, probably in the game right now, is the Whirlwind Barbarian build. I'm 90% sure this is going to get nerfed because it just seems ridiculous. Like, it rewards you for taking damage and then you do more damage by taking damage and just continuously sit spinning around in a whirlwind doing tons of damage. So... Right now, it seems really powerful. I think if they nerf it, it's not going to be tier 1 anymore. And I think they probably will nerf it, especially with Asmogold playing it. <laughs> Bless him. And then we've got the Necromancer. This is um, the class my wife's currently playing. Really solid class. I think leveling-wise, it's going to be pretty quick. Got massive area of effect clear. Also, probably one of the most diverse classes in the game in terms of how you can build it. Which means if they nerf certain aspects of it, you're still going to be in the running for like a really solid build. So I think the Necromancer is a really safe bet. Also one of the coolest looking classes that like you can just have an army of undead. Next we have the Sorcerer. So I I actually, I didn't really like the Sorcerer initially when I was kind of like playing it. But when you like get all the skills for it, oh my god it pops off. It's probably like the most fun I've had in the game to be honest. The Frost Sorcerer build is incredible, super survivable, does tons, tons of damage. Massive area of effects and slowing abilities. Also combo that with shock for like loads of critical damage. You're essentially really fast, super survivable because you can teleport away from bosses and just take them on 1v1. Um, I Late game, I don't know how she's going to be, but historically she's always been good in PvP. So Sorcerer, probably pretty high up. I'd say she's probably like, on all the classes, end game wise, probably going to be like middle tier. But I think, you know buffs and nerfs she's always going to be consistently good so like a safe bet for those people who like to play mages then we have the rogue she, the rogue is a bit of a glass cannon i will say right now i'm going to be playing the rogue in this playthrough in my opinion the rogue is the fastest character to level right now in the entire game like easily just how i'm going to be building it and leveling it in this like live stream series that we're doing um you'll see what i mean like you can just level her so fast her area of effect clear is incredible uh, i think the main difference is going to be when you get to end game and you're going to lack a bit of survivability but your speed and movement is going to be really good so it's going to be like a skill difference on how good you are at doing loads of damage but also being survivable um that's going to be the difference between the good rogue players and then the rogue players that just die all the time and aren't doing damage when they're dead. But when they're alive, they do a lot of damage. So I think the key here is balancing survivability with damage on the rogue. That would be my two cents. And then we have the Jurid. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys, not played the Jurid. She can become a werewolf though. And because I played Skyrim, that to me is like really cool. Being a werewolf or a werebear. Which you can also um, find in Skyrim, interestingly. Um, I think she's really slow to level once you get to the end game. Like, she's had some buffs recently on the day one patch. Probably going to be in a good spot, but I can't give you my impressions on what the Druid's like. I do know that overall, 
from the surveys I've done. Necromancer is the most popular class. Jurid is the least popular. Um, all these classes, the Barbarian, Sorcerer, and Rogue, are pretty much even on, on terms of the player base being excited about them. So, morning, morning. Thanks for waking up and uh, joining the stream, Battle Brothers. And Dan, thanks for being a member for 20 months. You're a true legend, true Battle Brother. So here we are. Let's begin by selecting the Rogue and building the ultimate viking -er rogue looking character obviously i'm going with a male i've got it on medium graphics by the way just because i'm streaming uh we're going to customize it we've got some presets though this guy looks the most like me so i'm going to customize this dude uh let's actually i mean i am pretty pale let's be honest i don't go outside a lot and there's not really any sun in the uk if you've seen sun in the UK, it's probably just a green screen. We don't actually have sun here. So I think, I think just here. That's way too tanned. Probably there. This is like undead. I'm probably here. What do you guys think? I think I'm more pale, but I'm going to go for this skin color anyway. Uh, my eye color? I don't actually know what my eye color is. But I'm sorry. What color eyes would you say? I think it's like a blue color. What do you guys think? You guys didn't see one. So Can you see now? What color do you think that is? I can't look at the chat and at you, so... I think it's like... A, a medium blue, or is it more of like a, a light green? Or a cr I don't know. Ice blue. Ice blue. Okay. Great. I'll, I'll zoom out of my face now. Sorry about that. There's not an ice blue. Okay, a light blue. We're going for light blue. Um, okay, next. Hairstyles. Obviously, I'm going to review the build, uh, the beard options. This is the most important part of the game for me, is how good the beards actually are. So, we've got to do hair first. This is like Camelworks' hair, who's probably going to be playing with us at some point during our livestream series. Which I'm very excited about because we've never played a video game together. This is um, a bald man. No hair. Other hair. This is pretty sick, actually. The, the top knot. The dreadlocks top knot. Another style of top knot. Just average. Ponytail. Almost can't see this guy. That looks very uh, tailored. This is where I'm at, I think. It's the mohawk. It's the closest they've got to my hairstyle, to be honest. Just with... It almost looks like balding on medium graphics, to be honest, on the side of his head. But we'll take it. We'll take it. Uh, I'm Where where am I at? I'm probably at like this blondy brown hairstyle. Not ginger, but blondy brown. I don't know what that is. It looks like a ginger man going white. So I'm going, I'm going here. Look at that. Look at that. I wish my hair swayed like that. Look at that. Oh, damn. You guys are naming eye colors that weren't on the list. It's not very helpful. The side profile. It looks good. I don't like the earring, but it looks cool. Um, okay, so now we need the, the facial hair. We'll start at number one. No facial hair. So I actually did a poll recently to discover how many of you watching the channel have a beard. And I was uh, very impressed, I must say, that 40% of you have what I would consider to be a beard. Um, about another 40% of you have, like, stubble. And then the rest of you are clean-shaven, like this. Hopefully you're not as oily as this, but clean-shaven. He looks very sweaty. Oh, we went from... Uh, probably like a below average man to to a god, essentially. Look at this. That's a beautiful beard. That's that's amazing. I you know that's a great beard. I like that. I think we may go for that. Oh, this is quite. That is more of a a, a tamed beard. I do like it. Uh, a goatee. I mean, you know, you've got to fill in this bit still, but but it's a nice look. Um. Not a fan of this. The handlebar moustache, a classic. You can't go wrong. Uh, this is pretty cool. Just just really committed to the moustache. I mean, look at that side profile. 
I mean, they're going to find you if they see your silhouette and you've you've been caught on camera or something. I don't know what this is. This is like, I think if we were playing on a higher graphic setting, there would be some kind of stubble here. But right now it looks like, I don't know what that is. Uh, okay, this... It looks cool, but on medium graphics, it doesn't look as good. I mean, this is a fuller beard. That's pretty good. And then we have clean shaven again. So we're obviously going for this option. As if there was any any debate there. Um, and then we've got makeup options. Let's go through this next. I, I don't really know what makeup I should go for. But the eyeliner looks pretty awesome. Purple eyeliner. I mean, this just looks quite satanic. Um, goth makeup. Some nice eyeshadow. Oh, um, don't know what that is. I'll have to ask the wife about this one. Some iridescent looking makeup. Wow. Amazing. I think we're going to go for no makeup, to be honest. I kind of just like the na El Natural look. The Overgrown Barbarian. What jewelry can we have? There's actually 33 options here, so what? bear with me. No jewelry? Oh, okay. This is actually some Norse looking earrings. I can dig that. Uh, I don't know what that is. Um, some some clams. Uh, oh, the bone earrings look pretty sick, actually. Very natural. Oh, this is a raven skull. This is very Odin. And then on the other hand, you have like a bit of bone. Okay, number six is good. Don't like this. Um, the bull nose ring. Yeah. Some rune stones. Fully committed to every piece of jewelry you can find. Um, other stuff. Oh, what's that? That's cool. It's a little red trinket. The hoops. You know what they say? The bigger the hoops. Okay, there's some cool there's some cool jewelry options. They have a lot of jewelry options. Big rune stones. The nose ring again. Okay, I think we're on number six. This little uh, raven skull looks pretty cool. It's almost lost in my beard, but hey. That is a man's beard. Yes, exactly. Look at that. It needs a little bit of trimming, but I'll take it. Uh, now we need to do the tattoos. This is equally important. We have six body markings. I'm sure we can buy more if we open our wallet. Let's zoom out here. Okay, so this is number one. The sneaky snake. Um, I don't know what this is. Oh, just no tattoos. Just sweat. Um, there's some cool tribal looking... Actually, it looks like flower markings, to be honest. We can also change the color of this. Uh, this is interesting. This looks like I didn't know what tattoo I wanted, so I just end up having everything on my body. Especially this little knife thing. I mean, that just looks more like a tramp stamp, really. Um, this... In battle. This is cool. With the free arrows and the different satanic writings. Big fan of this. This looks like I've done a ritual on my body. Looks cool in blue as well. We have the off shoulder. The uneven tattoo. I think that's it. Oh no, we got this one. This one. This one. This one. And some other stuff. That's quite cool. This is also quite cool. We can also make it blood, which is really nice. Just covered in blood or satanic writing. What do you guys think? I think we're going for... Where is it? This one back here. I like this one. And, uh, I mean, obviously the colors, you can cover yourself in chalk. Blue paint. The blue paint's quite cool. Orange. Scars. Scars is quite interesting. Enna. Or blood. I think blood is cool. Yeah, if you guys want to grab the game, by the way, you can get it at a discount uh, in the description, I believe it's currently at. Okay, I think we're going for this. Um, we're not going to go on hardcore. Um, what should we call our character? Usually I go with Assin Assassino, like in Assassin's Creed, where like in the movie where someone gets stabbed in the trailer and then some dude shouts assassino and for that reason i just call all my assassin characters that but i think we can do better here i think we can go for it's an online game we can come up with something funny the blood baron 
The blood scar is the best. I'm glad you agree. Ah, uh, yeah. Blue is cool because sometimes a black tattoo will fade to a blue color. That's because you didn't use sun cream. Uh, okay, I think we're going to go for one, one night stab. Can you have free spaces? No. One night stab. I think that's funny. Okay, so we have a good choice here. Do you want to go on veteran difficulty? You get 20% more experience. Or do you want to go on world tier 1 adventurer difficulty? You have to unlock the hardest difficulty. So what I'll probably do is play through on the easy difficulty and then play through again on the hardest difficulty in the game. There is an argument to be said for what way the fastest way is to level. I would say, based on other people who are good at speedrunning the game, veteran is slightly faster by 10 minutes to get to the higher levels from some of the tests i saw them do however for the majority of people playing especially through the story and the bosses having like half the amount of health world tier one is going to be the fastest way to level and i'm actually quite interested in going through the story on live stream just enjoying the story the first time around and then going through on the hardest difficulty afterwards and slowly, you know, gearing out over there. So I think I'm going to go for this. Uh, I already played through on the beta on the veteran difficulty. So, so I'm more interested in kind of story, farming up really quickly. Um, and also comparing it, my experiences. We will turn the game up to veteran now and again though. But for now, we're going to leave it on that and start the game. Oh no, there's a queue. Oh, thank God. We're fine. Haha, you see? It paid off. Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was. And Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall. It's a good hair choice that, that this guy's gone for here. It's Odin's Raven there. You can get a horse in this game, by the way, but we have to unlock it later. You just spent a hundred bucks to make it take longer. Oh no, the update. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh my god, it's Odin. He's looking over us. Or is that just a rock? It's a statue. Of a woman. feeling quite hungry. Tasty. I wouldn't be startled. That's a lie. No, everything's reset. We have to, we all have to start again since the launch. Otherwise, it wouldn't be fair for people who hadn't brought the game yet. Just curl up in the fetal position here and hope for the best. Ah. 
Yeah, I mean, that wolf was just killing for fun, right? Oh, look, there he is! There he is! <sighs> Have one of those wet dreams. Yeah, that nose ring in the cold weather would be a mistake. If this was a survival game, I you'd be... Find better shelter before I freeze. You'd be done. That would be it. Yeah. So we can dodge Reno and we can attack. So the build I'm going for, guys, uh, I will link it right in the description at some point, but you'll have to bear with me because I'm, I'm playing the game right now. Um, but essentially, what it's going to give us is unlimited energy and just massive clear. Like, we'll be able to speed through the game, enjoy the story together, uh, and then we'll play it through again on, like, the hardest difficulty. Obviously, if I was really interested in leveling up as fast as possible, I would be playing with friends. Um, and that's because the group buffs you get, experience gains you get for playing with groups is ridiculous like it's actually unreal i think it's a bit unfair to solo players but don't worry okay here we go this is the first village another abandoned town demons everywhere fangs in the dark ah, he bit me careful he's a wild one hello there Kind stranger, what's going on here? What's it to you? Oswin, hush! I'm sorry, wanderer. You've come at a difficult time. This madman just stumbled into town and started causing trouble. Demons spilling from the ruins. Kill us all. Kill us all. Ruins? What is he talking about? Come, I'll explain. Whoa, she's a ghost. You walked through us. I'm going to turn the volume up a bit. Boop. Staring in the ruins to the north. That poor monk back there must have gone inside. Even a holy man like him was driven mad by whatever he saw. I see, I see. Finally, shelter from the storm. I'm sorry, it's a bit cramped. <laughs> Just insult her in a cave. as soon as you show up. What is this place? Uh, nothing special about our little town, but it's home. What about the monk? We'll do what we can for him. Might have to keep him in the shed for now, though. He tried to bite off Oswin's fingers. It's not very nice, is it? Can you tell me about the people here? Alenta went a bit deaf last winter. You might need to speak up around her. She does have a Russian accent. Maybe she's from the North Russian Winterlands. It's not safe here. Could you protect us from whatever is out there? We have nowhere else to turn. I'm going to kill whatever's in those ruins before it gets the chance to kill me. Truly? Oh, thank you. No problem. Whoa, we've leveled up. One skill point to spend. Okay, so this is the skill trick, as you can see. Our skill point, our first skill point is going to go into here, into Puncture. Throw a blade a short distance, dealing 6 damage. Every third cast slows enemies by 20% for 2 seconds, so you can stack it. Critical strikes will always slow. This is going to be uh, pivotal to our build and killing bosses later. Especially for leveling. If Devmir is taking up all the space by the fire, just give him a shove. <laughs> Fire's looking good. But I should watch it a little longer. To make sure it doesn't go out. <laughs> of course, of course. What's that? Y you say something? Let me help you out. So this dude heals us. Can this guy's selling stuff. Dangerous. Whoa, 300 gold? Jesus. Need to get some money. Alright, let's go into the frost then towards this... This, um... Mysterious guy. Mysterious ruin that the uh, villagers are telling us about. I'm really excited to experience the story in Diablo. It's like one of my favorite parts of initially like playing through the game. 
I just think it's so awesome. They put so much effort into all the cutscenes, and you know, unlocking those cutscenes just makes it satisfying. You know, die. Got a critical. Nice. Into the dungeon we go. It's 6.35 in the morning in Texas. Hell yeah! Are you going to have, like, breakfast and watch the stream? That sounds like a fun thing to do. I mean, at this point, there's not really much point in looting all the stuff beyond us gearing our character out and progressing it. It's not like we're going to get much that's actually useful to us at this point before we, um, you know, finish the game and then turn it onto the much harder difficulties with a good character build. And then we can really progress our gear. And that's the point, you know, we'll focus on that later. Right now, we just want storyline. Strider's shoes. Mate, I need to put on these shoes because they're definitely better. Now I have some arm wraps as well. Hello, skeletons. Mate, just flinging knives at skeletons. Would that actually work? I feel like blunt damage would be more effective. Wait. Hello, anyone home? No. No treasure chests in here. We're not going to fully explore the, uh, the dungeons. Demons. Get wrecked. Uh, unless there is a good reason for doing so. Like, there's some dungeons we want to visit in Act 2 because of the character build I've got planned. There's, like, one specific weapon we need that just turns us into an absolute decimator of, of yeah. demons. And we will get to that. Ha! Huh. But for now, onwards to the first boss. Wherever he is hiding in here. I want to take out this summoner dude first so he doesn't spawn his little friends. There we go. You just started work. Ah, I'm distracting you. Have they had any server issues? They had some, obviously, when the game launches, which is why I was asleep. Um, but since then, no issues logging in or anything. Um, my wife's been playing since this morning. She's not had any issues. It's just like, you know, classic AAA company tries to launch uh, a popular video game. Okay, Rex, son. You gotta go this way. Ooh, we got a tunic. Have a look at this. Plus 17 armor. And it actually, I'm starting to look cool now, boys. Let's go. Color coordinated. What's in there then? Some gold and Already. lots of health that I don't need. They forgot to play their, pay their AWS cloud bill. Problem. Don't hide from me, you shaman. We'll pop off once we get uh, spinning blades on this build. Not ready yet. Chamber of cooling. And some kind of demonic circle. What's all this then? Decapitated priest, eh? Oh. Hello there. The sacred baron. So this boss is pretty easy. He just like ground pounds you every now and again. And you can just carry on walking and dodging away from him. And then he has like a little session where he starts summoning these minions, the Hellions, towards him. And after that, he's going to jump in here. And uh, we can just go ham with our abilities on him. Dodge the ground pound and continue going ham on him. At this point, early on in the game, the gameplay is pretty simple. We have one skill. But it gets much more exciting as we level, I promise. Excuse me, sir. Where are you going, mate? Here, Rex, son. x foul. Yeah. 
He looks really tired of the spike, doesn't he? Oh, mate. You poor sod. You just can't handle this. All I have is throwing knives. I want to attack right now. Easy, let's go. Got some new pants. I'm excited for this. Ooh, yeah, okay. Got a new bow, which I'll never use. Um, magic sword. I mean, there are some good leveling bow builds, but they're just not as good as my build. So let's go up the ladder. Is Diablo 4 better than Diablo 3? Too early to say. I mean, at least it's gained as a service, so I guess they're going to continue to support it for longer. Yeah. But we'll, time will tell, you know. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet. Let's go back to the inn and tell this lady that we sorted out her problems. We'll sell this person our stuff. You've returned. I have indeed. The old ruins are clear. Your town should be safe now. Truly. Ha! Huh. By the light, you are heaven sent. Oh, I'm so sorry. We, we haven't any coin to offer. But we have hot stew, good company, and... Stay for a pint. Wash out the taste of the stew. <laughs> Thanks. We'd be honored if you'd join us. To our savior. <laughs> it's a trap. <laughs> this is just like one of the best intros to a video game I've played in a long time. Oh, slowing down. They poison does. Ah, that was their plan all along. Knife sword build, yeah, for leveling it's better than a bow, in my opinion, for sure. So much faster clearing enemies. I'll show you as we play, mate. My face expression. <laughs> I saw my corpse, and from my mouth, cruel hatred. Father burned his children on a pyre, and a mother molded a new age from the ashes. He's singing the prophecy. I saw the weak made strong, a pack of lambs feasting on wolves, tears of blood rained on a desert jewel, and the way to hell was torn asunder. Such a sick intro. Then came a spear of light, piercing hatred's heart, and he who was bound in chains was set free. Rathma's prophecy. That's talking about Diablo being set free. I'm just so hyped for the story of this. Now we can experience the whole thing. I'm live with you guys. still on fleet though. By mother's blood, by mother's body, so uh, shall you witness her glory before you die. <laughs> Not ready yet. The 
coming! The whole damp village! Get up! Get up! We have to fight our way out! There! Take them! May the light preserve us. Damn. I hope the whole game is done. Should have leveled up. <laughs> hey, Rex, son. I like how they're all named villagers that you've spoken to. <laughs> oh, so let's actually quickly level up. Okay, so our next point we're going to put into enhanced puncture. Gain two energy when puncture damages a crowd control enemy. So obviously, puncture crowd controls um, after the third hit. And then you get energy from hitting them again. Um, so really good for keeping your energy up against bosses. Then after that, we're going to go through Twisting Blade. You impale an enemy with your blade, dealing 18 damage. And making them take 8% increased damage from you while impaled. Then after 1.5 seconds, the blades that you impaled them with then return to you. So by doing this, you can basically like make these blades fly through tons of mobs and do loads of damage. So you'll see this sort of come into play as we go. Uh, and then that's all our points. Nice. Here we go. Let's break out Priest. So we stab this guy. And we come over here. Oh, we can't show you that because uh, there's not enough people. You are blessed like us now. <sighs> that was all of them. Light willing. So what she means by saying that we are blessed like her now is because we've had some of Lilith's blood that we can now see the visions that they see. You're a madman. You're the madman from the shed. Madman? Those heretics drugged me after I returned from the ruins. Just like you. I came to my wits and escaped. Tried to get inside the chapel, but it was locked and... <coughs> What manner of evil is this? Petals? Of blood? Uh, they... They must have fed them to me. A blasphemous ritual. How did they learn this? Perhaps the answer lies in the chapel. They kept it locked up for a reason. The key might be on that woman who was leading them. I've already got the key. I am one step ahead. Toxic Male Gamer. Thanks for the $10 donation. Yo, ESO. Love your Skyrim videos. Glad to see you're a fan of the Diablo series. I know I can trust you to deliver a proper gameplay review. Bravo, sir. Thanks from Carly. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. I will give you my proper feedback on what I feel about the game. Do not fear. So we've got to go to the church and check it out, apparently. It's this way, old man. I'll like go in first. Petal. Like the ones I was fed. Is this real? Strange petals. They seem Only to be floating. fire can cleanse the darkness in this place. Oh. Flashback. This is a church of the light. Shameful. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <laughs> and yet you stray from it at every opportunity. You drink. And gamble. You covet and steal. Shameful. Oh.
in is their birthright. My children. The Lords of Hell are coming to devour our world. Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. The faith yeah. has taught you to deny your heart's desire and turned you into a prisoner within yourself. Break the chains and discover who you were meant to be. Break the chains and be beautiful in sin. Damn. Oh boy. Resist! Resist her temptation! Vani, it's me. I brought your child into this world. That man just wants to gamble. Yo. Manny, are you okay? Oh, I don't think Jesus is in this one, guys. Who's this? They have awakened, Mother. The first of many. Go to the dry steps and continue your preparations. Now, our true work begins. Damn, that's awesome. You came to thank the light. So Lilith is the mother of all the humans in Sanctuary. She had a relationship with the Archangel, you know the storyline, and it was like a forbidden relationship. So they created Sanctuary and that's why all the humans exist here in Sanctuary. So now she's come back to protect her humans from the threats. So it's it's going to be interesting how this unfolds because you've got like the Archangel on one side and Lilith on the other side and the Archangel wants to be redeemed. It's just a, a massive like, you know, ex-girlfriend situation really. It's it's going to be exciting to see how this plays out. Isif. What were you doing here in Nezavek? Looking for the town priest. He stopped sending tithes, and I came to find out why. As I neared the village, I sensed darkness around the ruins. I went to investigate, found the priest's body. Demons. Foolishly, I took shelter in the Vesk and ate their food. You know the rest. You are a foolish man. How did I get here? You collapsed inside. I thought the darkness had swallowed you. I dragged you here and put this cursed place to the torch. What happened to you in there? I saw... a vision. A horned demon. She said the Lords of Hell are coming. She wanted to help the people survive. Help them? She called them her children. And they welcomed her like... a mother. Mother. No. It cannot be. Oh, it is. I must report to the cathedral. Listen, there is a hermit to the northeast. A man of questionable loyalty. But he knows of the forbidden. He might be useful to us. Bring him to the cathedral in Kiovashad. And you will be in the light's favor. Very well. Quest complete. Play prayers for salvation. And we got like a new amulet here, which uh, we're not currently wearing anything. So and this is also better armor. And it's blue. Nice. 
Who is mother? Do not call her that. It is a demon, Lilith. The gospel says that she will walk among the people, posing as the mother of sanctuary. If she is here, uh, it is humankind's own sin that has brought her. Imagine being so sinful that you summon a demon. Who is the hermit you want me to speak to? He surrounds himself with dark knowledge. Nice. Tread carefully, and pray he has not fallen to Lilith as well. I shall indeed, sir. So, one sec before we go, I'm just going to quickly turn up the volume of this. There we go. That's better. Now, we can open the map. We've got to go over here and find this hermit. So let's go to... Actually, no, we want to go north. Lisa! Oh my god! Thank you so much for the donation! Enjoyed your Skyrim videos for years. Been playing since day one. Super excited for Diablo 4. My kid and I started co-op last night. Oh, dude, that's like family goals for me. About to start again this morning. Thanks for all you shared with us. Oh, I hope you have a wonderful time and enjoyed the storyline together and get to end game and just go nuts. What classes are you playing? Altar of Lilith. There's loads of these spread out around the game. And we can use them to get permanent stat boosts. I'll probably run through off stream, like collecting them all, but um, maybe I'll do a video about them, I don't know. But they're pretty, pretty pivotal to pick up at some point in your playthrough if you want to get that end game character. In fact, there's a little delve here that we're going to jump into before we go further, just for some little experience boost. The Ice Worn Cellar. These are kind of little, little instances that are all over the game with random stuff on the side. There's a skeletal captain there that we can go ahead and hit. Don't have enough energy. Yeah, wreck some. Anything else here we can get? Not really. No, we're good. What class are you playing? I just got here. I'm playing a rogue. A roguey boy. Oh my god, it's a war from Lord of the Rings. Did you guys hear about the new Lord of the Rings MMO? Apparently that is a thing. I'm gonna grab this shrine, get like a buff here. I'm gonna run over here. Take out this dude. Oh, he's got some hide pants, which we'll obviously pick up here. Kill those guys. Need more time. Nice. Get wrecked. Is there anything else that is useful? We can't jump across here, can we? No. I need more we have time. To get all the way round the spider nest instead. It is. It looks great, doesn't it? I'm only playing on medium. Okay, let's drop this in here because it does more damage. So, like, with these blades, for example, I can hit this guy with these blades and then I can dodge over there and they just all die. Same with these spiders. Just put the blades down and they just run through the enemies. So I can just carry on walking while killing everything. Uh, the only difference is, is that you might have to go back and pick up some items sometimes, like, uh, actually that bow was better. All these spider hatchlings just spawned. I'm not ready. Direct. Gotta go under here. And then we're almost in this next zone here. Where apparently we're gonna find this hermit. Your victim's blood is your war paint. Yes. Exactly that. And I'm going to be grabbing these uh, ingredients as we go because they're actually pretty helpful to us. We're going to need to make some health potions and stuff later. So, right I'm now it's not very important, but 
later it will definitely be something we have to do. So the Hermit's Hut is somewhere around here in the uh, northwest. The windswept cabin. Before we go inside, there is a chest behind it, which we'll grab. Ah! Ooh, some gloves. I need some gloves. Nice. Some creepy sounding music in the background. I need more time. Let's get inside, see what he's doing. Is anyone here? Hello? Anyone home? Whatever is brewing smells awful. Dear. Mortar and pestle, a healer's tool, freshly used. Herbs and mushrooms, organs, not for cooking. A bookshelf. Back here. Indeed. I really want a bookshelf like that in my house. Specimen Short notes. Fangs. Young. Freshly turned. An easy kill. Further south than the others. They're spreading. Ah. Coated in dried blood. This is intended to catch human or beast. Strange skull. Looks like a cool mask. Oh. Do this. That dude's looking like a raid boss. to join me for supper. I'm bloody hungry. That's quite the story. I wish it wasn't true, but it is. Why did I have that vision? Thank those friendly villagers. They gave you the blood of Lilith. The blood of a demon. Not just any demon. The daughter of hatred. The mother of sanctuary. She was banished ages ago. But this world is her creation. <sighs> it was prophesied she would come back. What does she want? That's the question. Sanctuary has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. A war between angels and demons. But Lilith serves neither side. She has her own plans for us. And me? Am I corrupted? Not sure yet. But you two share a connection. What will you do about it? Use it. Find out what she's after. Good. Then we're in this together. Rest while you can. Then we'll start in Kiovashad. If we can't stop Lilith, we'll all be damned. How is it so far? Literally just tired, my dude. So I'll let you know soon. Enjoying it so far, though. Who goes hunting with a battle axe anyway? Oh, for deer. Hunting for deer with a battle axe. What a mad lad. An odd assortment of empty bottles reeking of strong spirits. Why are you hiding them outside in a sack? It's a bit strange. It's close to the city. Lilith's evil is spreading. Good, I need to kill some demons for experience. Oh, some gold. Nice. Bam, bam. Oh, I just love the sound in this game. So good. Oh, 
Hello there. What's this? A new dagger? Put that in there. Where are you off to, mate? I I'd live to see all this. A tunic? That's better than my one. What is this statue? The angel in Arius. I'm sure you've heard the Cathedral of Light babbling about their holy father. Well, he's real. An angel walks among us. And when he learns that Lilith is here, blood will flow. They are ancient enemies. They'll drag the whole damn world into their feud unless we can stop it. Ex-girlfriends have that effect. Kiobashad lies just ahead. Oh, the statue's actually been defaced as well. The inscription is badly marred by claw marks. May the light of faith in Arius do on upon do un upon all who travel of this land turn face towards it something and find some strength renewed? Something like that. Yeah. I heard some is it the deer that was smashing stuff over here? What's this? A little shield or something. It's going to town. Look at this sentry, it looks awesome. Hold. To enter the city, you must We first... have no time for this. What is this about? <sighs> to enter Kiobashad, you must perform a cleansing ritual. It's a meaningless gesture, but some people take comfort in it. How dare you? <laughs> Just let him through, lad. I've tried for years to get Lorath to do the ritual. Fine. But this one stays. I'll meet you inside. Alright. <laughs> Take a piece of holy cedar wood from the shrine and inscribe it with the sin which troubles you. Okay, what sin then is troubling me? Cast it into the brazier. As the fire burns the wood, so too will the light burn away your sin. Uh, okay. Inscribe fear, anger, pride. Is fear a sin? Or greed? Inscribe nothing but scribbles into the wood. That's what I did last time, and he actually commented on what I, uh, I put in. Let's go for pride. Pride. Is it a sin to be prideful? Magic. Okay, I'm done. I've done a stupid ritual. Let me in. It's done. Good. You must feel as though a great weight has been lifted from you. Sure. Welcome to Kyovashad. To play this, you need to have played the other ones. I mean, you don't need to have, but the storyline is much more enjoyable if you have, I would say. But if you want to play the old ones, like, oh, some of the... It goes back. It's It goes back a long way. And some of the gameplay is very different to how good the game is now. Not that oh, it's bad. What did you write on a little piece of wood? Something about hubris or pride, perhaps? Pride, uh, there you go. It matters little, I suppose. Interesting how he always knows what you wrote. A horse? You're going somewhere? I'm off to the dry steps in search of that pale man from your vision. I must know what part he plays in all this. But first, I need you to retrieve something of mine while I finish my negotiations. A merchant in the center of the city has it. Just tell him I sent you. All right, I'll go do your, your legwork for you. What are the villagers doing in these ruins? Sacrificing. Summoning demons. Honing all the wonderful gifts that Lilith gave them. He's an old man. Old men are always triggered. Tell me about Inarius. The cathedral loves to go on about him. His imprisonment in hell, his valiant escape, his glorious return here, the world he created. But they never mention how being tortured in hell for a few millennia turned you into an ass. <laughs> I mean, he was tortured. Lilith's return was prophesied. See, that was the intro prophecy that that guy who was carrying us on the cart was singing. There was a prophecy, yes. 
that foretold the rise of the prime evils, the return of Lilith and Inarius, the doom of our world. Inarius adopted the prophecy for his own selfish purposes, put it in the Cathedral of Light's gospel, and made it seem like he would be the hero to save us. But he, consequentially, actually ends up Crap being... Tattoos, sway back, cloudy eyes. This poor thing is practically crowbait. With what you're paying, you're lucky she has four legs. <laughs> Love the negotiation. I feel like Inarius brought the prophecy down on us, really. Okay, so this is the merchant shop we have to go to. Let's actually sell to this I lady quickly. Furs, skins and steel. We can also um, break the stuff down as well and refine it, but for now, we're just Good selling deal. stuff. Father Bliss. Laura sent me. Ah, so the old man's finally decided to buy it back. Knowing him, he didn't mention coin, did he? <laughs> If he wants his weapon, you will need to pay. How much gold do you want? Oh, Lorraf's pole arm. 20 gold. Thank God that's not 1,300. While clearly old, its ornate blade has been kept sharpened and polished. As though it would be needed again at any moment. Okay. I'll take that. Cheers, Wait. buddy. The old man sold me this too. He said he didn't need it anymore, but... I think he'd want it back all the same. Strange no amulets. An amulet of unique design that shows wear from years of use, perhaps as a badge of office, cannot be salvaged. I think that's like a badge of office. Represents the organization they're a part of. Let's just unlock the portal. There we go. Now we can fast travel back here whenever we want. Thanks for joining the stream. How's the Rogue? Really enjoying the Rogue gameplay so far. I think it's definitely uh, one of the fastest classes in the entire game to level. Uh, and I'm kind of excited just because it fits like how I, I like the gameplay to be. Yep, waypoints, exploring sanctuary, different dungeons, events, and so on, quests. Obtaining renown will grant rewards at certain thresholds. View the stages of your renown for each region, so you can like complete a region essentially and get rewards for it. All right, buddy. Oh, we can buy a horse now. This is, I think this is like the pre-order skin. But you have to finish the progress before you can order it. Oh, no. The night one looks sick. What's this? It's a weird saddle. Don't know what trophies are. I guess you can put like a trophy on the side of the horse, like in The Witcher. I had to pay for your weapon, old man. Ah, apologies. He also gave me this amulet. What is it? The mark of the Haradrim. An ancient order of scholars and mages. Sworn to protect sanctuary from demons. These days, we are few in number. There is another Haradrim. Donan. His breadth of knowledge about demons is equal only to his hubris. Sounds like he could help us. Hmm. You should seek him out in Skosglan. But don't forget about the cathedral. They'll be expecting you, and they might prove to be useful allies too. You're not coming with me? I'm going to the dry steps to find out who that pale man is. Join me when you can, just... Be careful. Your ties to Lilith, the visions you see. You are the key to finding her and stopping whatever she has planned. Sometimes our paths in life are set to collide. We just don't know it. Whether it is by accident or fate's hand, there is nothing we can do about it. The wanderer lost in the storm, fed the blood of Lilith, saved by a lone monk. Different lives and incidents drawn together. By what? Destiny? Or 
or some greater power pulling the strings. I did not know. Great prologue. But at the time, I thought I had the chance to protect humanity from the daughter of hatred. The Wanderer's connection to her gave me hope. <laughs> Imagine that. One does not simply hope in Diablo. Terminator 6. My roleplay is ruined. Quest complete. Missing pieces. And we got some new shoes. Let's go, boys. Find your purchases. Locate the map tab with this. Contain new purchased items. Purchase armor, weapons, and other character cosmetics that are found in the wardrobe. Purchase mounts found in the stable. Let me just tell you where to buy things. Purchase emotes that are found in the action. Okay, nice. Not that nice, to be honest. Okay, what well, we have one action point to spend here. We're going to go for advanced twisting, enhanced twisting blades. Deals 30% increased damage when returning. So we get even more damage on the return after we deploy them. Yeah. Pretty nice suit. Um, there's multiple quests here. However, we're going to go straight and continue on with the main quest. It's going to be our focus. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet. Playing fine on my part. Yeah, um, the stream should be running smoothly. For sure. Uh, the game is definitely running smoothly, so it's it's YouTube side. Um, make sure you are on the highest 1080p. We can talk to all these kids praising Anarius. Oh, glorious father. Thank you. Your light has cleansed the disease from my flesh. I am made whole in your radiance. Oh, praise the Lord. We were born in sin. Children of darkness. But the Father's light can be sought through penitence and faith. Walk in the light. Reverend Mother Prava. We must be ever vigilant against sin, brother. Yes, Reverend Mother. Let the light of Inarius burn away wickedness. Let not temptation lead you from his holy radiance. Let righteousness sear away corruption and sin. Cast out thy darkness, for only light must remain. Cast out thine darkness, for only light must remain. Is this the one from Nevest? Yes, Reverend Mother. Did Lorath not accompany you? He sent me on without him. Putting faith in that old man was a mistake. What could possibly be of greater import? Well, he knows. Lilith. So, you know. Hmm. We have received word from one of our knights of a demon sighting in Gale Valley. The description matches too closely to the sighting in Neves. If you would travel to Yelesna, and take stock of the events there. You would have the gratitude of the Cathedral of Light. I had thought to send Lorath, but... Again, he fails in his duty. With or without Lorath, the will of Inarius shall be done. Loving the enthusiasm of the character's voices. Here, take the knight's report before you go. I think uh, the voice acting is really good. I think it's a good level. I don't know if you're being sarcastic or what, but Lee. You have to let me know. Vigo's report. Reverend Mother, I received a report of a potential demon sighting. A horned woman near Yelesna Mines. Performed routine inspection. Nothing yet. Sent in priest and escort of knights. We'll report in when we find something. So we're going to go for advanced twisting blades here. When your twisting blades return, your active cooldowns are reduced by 0.25 seconds per enemy they pass through, which is just key. 
Because you can literally just be spamming this if you sort this build out in the right way. And we will be able to once we get um, Shadow Step and Dash down here. You know, we're just going to be laughing. Let's go and speak to the Reverend Mother about the notes report, God. You know of Laura. His skill is unmatched. But as you can see, he's not so reliable. It's not out of indifference. He went off searching for a pale man who accompanied Lilith. So someone is helping her. <sighs> How easily the souls of men sink to darkness. So currently we've not looked at the microtransactions. I know that they all are cosmetic. I don't know what the season passes will be like though um or you know the gear progression might be that like you would get an advantage by buying a season pass for example but that remains to be seen uh, we'll have a look at it later though i'm sure what do you know of lilith she is spawn of a prime evil mark my words nevesque was but the beginning she will kill again but our father the angel Inarius is prophesied to defeat her. Where there is faith, there need not be fear. What happened to Yelsna? One of our flock, the watch commander, Vigo, sent word of a demon sighting. A girl claimed to see a horned woman. The risk is too great to dismiss. Seek him out. He should be well into his search. Okay. We can discover what was going on with the guard who sent the report. Rathmer is the source of the cathedral's prophecy. He was but a messenger, destined to pass on the word. Only Inarius had the wisdom to interpret the prophecy's true meaning. The, the voice actor for Lorath is Ralph in ES in you could you could know from the Game of Thrones and a lot of other roles yeah I love that they employ you know good quality voice actors like this Got all the scribes here doing their little note taking I love the guard armor I really hope we can get that in the future right so We've revealed this area. We now need to go over here. We're going to go ahead and track that and work our way through this area towards that next location. An unforeseen visit. I need more time. I need more time. We can definitely do some quests and events along the way to help ourselves level up a bit faster, though. Is this early access? Yes, yeah, so this is early access, but the full game essentially is what we're playing with the day one patch. And the login issues have been fixed from last night, which is good, and why I also didn't bother playing last night. Oh look, there's a little event going on here, so we can just grab some. Oh, I'm not ready yet. Ooh, some nice shoes. Very good. What are you doing, buddy? Let's kill you first. There we go. Now he's free. I don't have enough energy. I need more time. Oh, do I have to destroy these clan shades? I see. That's how it works. We're the only one doing the event. Oh no, this guy's up now. I'm gonna go kill this shaman again. I need more time. I'm out of energy. And we'll run over here, kill this guy. Boom. Now I should be able to damage him. I don't have enough energy. And he's invulnerable again. My dude, these ice shamans are keeping you alive. What's this? Some ore. ore I need shots. more time. Oh, 
no more shame and skill. Don't have enough energy. Get wrecked. And now he's spawned another five. Need more time. Rites of Ascension. Cool. We got a bunch of cool armor from this. And a chest. What's this? Oh, we got some purple items. Very nice. Very nice. I got a new hat. Can I uh, hide my hat? How do I do that again? There was a way of doing it. I can't remember how. Uh, is it here? I can't be bothered to do it right now. We'll figure it out later. Don't want to waste your time. Right, let's head over to the objective with that big boost of experience. The cosmetics are okay, but completely optional. Yeah, I mean, some of them are selling for like 30 quid or something. So, you know, you definitely don't need to buy them. Demon's Heart. Come back for that. Sounds cool. <laughs> Those blades just kill everyone. Look at that. Easy, mate. I need more time. What's this? Beware. Beware, many lives have been lost in this canyon. Some say vampires lurk in the shadows. Well, I almost want to go this way now to our objective. Anything here? Oh, this is actually a town. I'm not ready yet. Not ready yet. Let's just quickly unlock this location. As we go, for the sake of speed. The night has teeth beyond these walls. Better with bed down here so that we see the dawn. Could really do some escaping with this game. What do you mean, like from real life? Do you think the stuff that the game gives you for free isn't cool there? Succubus. Need more time. Rex? Yeah, I'm liking this build so far. It's good fun. Definitely excited to unlock some more stuff though, so we can really take advantage of the possible damage we can do with this build. Out of energy. I'm out of energy. Help me, I'm Scottish. Yeah. Oh, stop empowering her. Lily will be pleased. Will she? Oh, hello. Big damage. Oh, get Rex up. Where's the challenge? Where's the challenge? I mean, we are playing on easy difficulty, I guess. A fiendish cone deck. How, how fiendish? Um, new shoes. I like it. I like it. Very good. Okay, let's continue on. Same shame there's a cooldown on the dodge. Dude, if there was no cooldown on the dodge, that would be busted. I mean, one of the reasons the rogue class is like one of the fastest in the game is because we have the ability to shadow step, dodge, and dash. So we have three inbuilt dodges. And I think that's going to be the key to the survival. Correct. Go down there. I'm low on I'm energy. Ready. I'm low on energy. Stop throwing spears at me. Yeah, this build gets really fun once you get shadows. Yeah, you get it. You get it. 
Still seems to be very good at wrecking things, even now. Gotta go up here. To get to Eldermain Keep. Almost there now. Hopefully I've taken the right fork in the path. Could have been either way, left or right. I've only played Necro and that was really fun. Necro looks incredible. My wife's on that right now. It looks really good. That was going to be my second choice. Or, new armor. Let's go. Really beautiful, man. Look at this view. In the rain. Just love it. I wish I could throw a knife with that force. I went axe throwing recently. Um, I won, by the way, out of all my friends. Just, just want to say Knight's that. Blessing. If you have needs, because I'm a true Viking. The watch my wife came second on, because she has actual it. Viking blood in her. Uh, Ebrin? What is this place? Can you feel it? <sighs> Eldheim is hallowed ground, my friend. Blessed with Anaris' holy light. Just being here is a way of lifting my spirits. Sounds a bit like one of the hobbits from Lord of the Rings. Tell me about Donna. Ah, you'll never meet a man with a bigger heart. Came to see about getting my son some work, and he hired the lad as a clerk, right on the spot. Don't know Not how bad. I'll ever repay him, but I'll find a way. Yeah, I played a lot during Close Peter. Okay, so we've got to go through here to this main quest objective. We can sell our stuff now before I forget. Up close and at a distance, I have weapons for any engagement. Any engagement, eh? I'll take it off your hands. I'll take it off your hands. This is the lady, Commander Angie. I'm looking for a Haradrim named Donan. Where'd she go? An old friend of his sent me. At this hour, I'd wager he's in the keep. Check with the guard at the door. Oh! Invisibility OP. She's clearly very self-conscious and doesn't want to be seen. Pray for me, Wanderer. I've asked Denarius for the strength to resist temptation, but I can't keep my hands from stealing. It's like they're possessed. Mate, if this or all these hanging corpses aren't a lesson to you or a warning, I don't know how I can help you. Right, let's go into the main courtyard. Hello? I have an urgent message for Dolan. He's upstairs in the great hall with his son. Keep it quick. I'm just allowed in. Just random adventurer. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, dude, look at this sick mosaic on the floor. This is cool. Amazing. Stone mural. In honor of the great... Or Roderick Mage Donan and the brave druids Eredar and Nafan, who vanquished the demon Ashrath and ended the days of Ash. I can't zoom out enough to see the statue, but you saw the legs. Oh, look, is this him? He's a fat boy now, isn't he? Dad, sit on the I need to be out in the field with the other knights. Why the rush, my boy? You know, I, I found some of my old Horadric tomes. Stay here, and we can go through them together. I can take some with me. We have a visitor. Ah, too much reading. That was it. This discussion is not over. Is there something you need? I have a message from Lorath. Wow. There's a name from another life. Has the old man finally come down from the mountain? With a warning. An ancient evil walks the land. The demon Lilith. And you know this how? Did you and Lorath discover something of interest? Perhaps this is all connected to what you saw, father. <clears throat> yes, I was just getting to that. There was an incident at my estate. Uh, probably best if we discuss it there. 
Go and have a look around for yourself. I'll meet you shortly, and then we can talk more. As for your request, <sighs> get to Bracetech. And be careful. Stay close to the other knight's penitent. I will. Don't worry. He's gonna die. Is this his dad's sword? Because this sword looks awesome. Look at this big ass barbarian two hander. Looks sick. What's your relationship with Lorath? We haven't spoken much in recent years, but the two of us have history. We are brothers of the Haradrim. I'm probably the closest thing to a friend he has nowadays. Forging bonds is not exactly a strength of his, as I'm sure you've noticed. Ah, yep, pretty much. Can you tell me more about the incident? It occurred just the other day, in the dead of night. I thought it was a nightmare at first, but unfortunately that is not the case. I have some things to finish up here, and then we will talk more at the estate. Very well. Let's go to this estate chief you liked talking about so much. It's just to the north. I'm gonna go down this way. Let me get out of the castle for a minute. No, it was a trap. Damn it. The view's nice though. Can I get out of here? No. I have another skill point to spend, but where's it gonna go is the question. I think we're going to get um the last point into fundamental puncture here. Now throw three blades in a spread, each doing 35% of its base damage. Hitting an enemy with at least two blades at once makes them vulnerable for two seconds. Easy. So now we can get loads of energy from this. But that's, um, by the end of this build, we'll have unlimited yeah. energy. So leveling is going to be like nutty fast. But for now, we just enjoy the story. And I'm going down this way. I need more time. I need more time. I don't care if any of these guys die. What the characters we meet? Walk in the light. You walk in the light. What do you think about the rogue class so far? Spare some kindness for an old soldier. Can I give him money? Here you go. Ah, thank you, wanderer. What did I give him? Hopes and dreams. What's your story? I was wounded in the days of Ash. I touched the demon's flame, though I was being brave at the time. I can still feel the fire dancing across my hands, burning the skin away. Everything hurts to touch. Except coin. <laughs> <laughs> I like this guy. I like that they added little NPCs like this to the game. Just kind of like fleshes it out and just gives it a bit more life, you know? Oh yeah, that's cool. I have no time for side quests, traveller. What are these? Ruins, huh? Get wrecked with my new AoE abilities. I hate swarm enemies in these types of games. Some iron chunks? I'll take it. Unlimited power, do it. Yes. Always unlimited power. One does not simply play Diablo without breaking the game. One does not simply play a balanced build. What's up, bro? How's it going, Adam? Steward Wilf Steward Wilfred. Welcome to Firebreak Manor, traveller. I'm here about the incident. Donan gave me permission to look around. Incident? That was all he said. I must be referring to his study. Something unsettling transpired there. Hmm. I wonder what happened. He's just gonna let me walk in and explore, I guess. I'll explore the rest of his house first. Might be some useful lore. There'll be nothing else, will there? Literally. I wish you had like a scan for interactable items. Yeah, here we go. Large book. A hefty tome entitled A Guide to the Weight and Measures of an Ancient Kejan Volume 2. The pages are well worn and riddled with handwritten notes. It says like bedtime story table. 
He's also an alchemist. Oh, he is a mage, so that makes sense. His son has the same book in his bedroom. Nothing interesting, to be honest. Let's go to his study. Jesus. This is the entrance to his hell, the study. Who has their study in a basement? Need to copyright? Get wrecked. I need it on a t-shirt, really. You know, an MCN I used to work with made me a t-shirt that said get wrecked on. And it was really cool. I helped them with the design, drew it out. And then when we stopped working together, they took the design as part of the contract, even though verbally we had an agreement that I kept anything that they made for us. MCNs, if you're a YouTuber, just like the worst deal possible. They literally just siphon money off people. And I was stuck in that contract for so many years. A weather tome entitled The Book of Wars. Notes are scrawled in the margins of a section about fire magic. Okay. Unfinished manuscripts. A stack of papers bearing the title The Fall of Astaroth. It appears to be an unfinished chronicle of Donan's battle against the demon. It's pretty awesome. So what's this, uh, this strange leather blood petals? I guess only we can see this. A vision? Give me a cool cutscene, let's go. Oh yeah, cutscene. mood lighting he's got in his office. There's a trap! This can't be. Praise the Lord! never seen that work before, usually they end up dying. Oh wait! So he also has... Oh. That was cool. That was really cool. Oh, the plot's A good. Signal hall. The ground's on fire from when she vanished. Trash Metallics, thanks for being a member for three months, Battle Brother. If you're sick at home today, wanted to give my best while I rest. Also, can you kill Nazim for me? <laughs> I'll try and find him. If he's here, I'll kill him. Don't worry. He will not survive. Uh, yeah, we gotta go upstairs. He, he enjoyed it, 100%. Yeah. Oh, mate, what's going on here? Correct. Look at these little peasants hiding. This guard looks so cool. He's got a little gap in his shield for the spear. Let's go, blood clan member. Don't worry, I'll save you, bro. So many enemies around. Let's loot the fallen brothers. We've got to fight our way out of the, the mansion. 
Why did he want us to go into this trap anyway? I need more time. Oh, is it poison in humans? Oh no. What's in here? Nothing. I'll save you, don't worry, mate. There's a bunch of other mobs here. Go all in. No, I don't want to be feared. Leave me alone. This solo is pretty fun. Ooh, there's some magical priests helping me out here. Goat men. They've never dared come so close to the estate before. Perhaps they were drawn by Lilith's presence. I saw a vision of her in your study. What do you mean, a vision? I don't fully understand how, but it isn't the first time. Full hmm. of surprises, aren't you? No wonder you caught Lorath's attention. Well, now you understand my predicament. The daughter of hatred in my own home. She must be furious I cast her out. That painting on your wall, who are the others in it? Why do you ask? Good question. Lilith seemed to leave after seeing them. The Fane and Arida. The druids who helped me slay Astaroth. Yes. Yes, I think you're onto something. I resisted her. So she might question them about the demon next. There are knights stationed in villages near the druids. If Lilith passed through, they must have seen her. How many Lilith cosplays will we see soon? <laughs> oh dear, probably a lot. What will you do now? I must see to the dead here. If I'd known they were in danger, I would have closed off the estate. You Damn fool. Lilith. She brought this on them. Well, you banished her. Lilith doesn't seem to believe that you destroyed Astaroth. Of course not. Demons are arrogant creatures. She would never accept that our kind could vanquish Astaroth. What troubles me is why she's looking for him. What does she want? Astaroth was from the realm of hatred. The place Lilith once called home. Perhaps therein lies an answer. I'll have to ponder this more. Do you think it's worth $70 or wait for it to be 40 I mean, you know, currently, like, you can play a few days early by paying more money. If you're really excited to play the game with your friends and you're all, like, jumping on, then, yeah, I guess it's worth the money because you're basically, like, playing for a weekend of entertainment, right? Um, but otherwise, if you're just going to play the game normally and you're not in any rush, then just, like, buy it when it releases, I guess. Tell me about Aradiah and Nathan. They were like brother and sister to me once. But life has taken us on different paths. Erida is consumed with her task of watching over the dead. I long for a time we can meet and discuss old histories like we used to. And the Fane. Well, it's a shame he's become so bitter. Lives like a recluse. Deep in the woods. Refuses to meet with me. Probably going to be a boss fight with him. <laughs> Why did you bring the cathedral? To Scrossglen. People either praise me or curse me for that decision. There is no middle ground. Druids like Nefane think I've given away their land to the Knights Penitent. What other choice do they think I had? After the days of Ash, we needed help. To rebuild and protect Scotsland. The cathedral was ready 
and willing. That's how they get you. It's the same in real life, too. <laughs> ah, there's a fast travel point here, boys. We gotta unlock this. Oh, I love the sound effects. Okay, so there's another quest there which we will ignore. I've gotta go over here now. The dry steps is here. Dude, we've just gone like a beeline. This is level 15. Ooh, maybe we should go back here do the level 8 quest. Which I think I have done in the previous beta, but... There's another quest here, level 12. Or one here, level 12. We're level 8 right now. I think we go here, Tarnish Luster, level 8. That makes sense. Okay, so next, uh, we're going to level up. Uh, I think the best option now is to maximize Twisting Blades as our DPS. Our main DPS. Um, actually, no. We want to get Dash next. We want to get Shadow Step and then Dash. Well, Dash and Shadow Step, I think, is the best shout. Um, so, Dash. Dash forward and slash enemies for 27 damage. So now we can reliably... Um, Twisting Blades, then dash, and then dodge, and then we get Twisting Blades to go through all the enemies, so it does big damage. Essentially how it works. So let's go travel back here. Lilith pulled a, pulled a my dad and left to get cigarettes. Yeah, I hate when that happens, man. Oh, hail the mother. A lot of my friends aren't getting this. Really, this is like the first game where I feel like all my friends are union... Or is it unanimously guessing this game? Why are they not getting it? They're just like not a fan time. of Diablo. How do I escape this city? Gotta go down there. Do I have anything good? Oh, this is plus 27 damage. Okay, 83. Plus 6. Cool. Gotta sell this other crap. Oh, you didn't want to sell this. Oh, what's this currency? Interesting. Yeah, I mean, just get it after it comes out then, on the 6th. The normal version. Hey Danny, can't wait to play for myself. Glad you're enjoying the stream in the meantime. There's a little event going on here. We're going to drop down, do this event, and then we're going to carry on. Get wrecked. Oh my god, that dash is insane. Hello there, battle brother. Ooh, nice. Hand grabs. Oh wow, I just showed up at the end of the event and got everything for it. I'll take it. It's worse than my current stuff. I've wasted my time. Beyond getting the experience, obviously. Let's go back towards the uh, the main quest. We're going to be able to move so rapidly across the map now. It's going to be beautiful. I need more time. No, you don't. Uh, you will move when I tell you to. So, we got to go over to this objective in the south. Yeah, it's up to you, right? Like, if you want to play through the whole story with your friends, then for sure, go for it. Has different values to different people, right? Expect the ancient obelisk. That's a trap! <laughs> oh, wait, do I need more people? Okay, well, let's, let's set this up. Oh, do we have to kill the enemies on the other ones? That makes sense. I need more enemies. Oh, in the pan. 
camera. Take those up. Got some werewolves spawning. Nice. And that one is full by the looks of it. Ah! doing nothing i like it pretty cool little event okay let's carry on to our objective i like that you get distracted by all the stuff you can do in this game. like it's cool right like i don't i'm kind of like oh i want to do the main story and and just focus on that for like the live stream stuff but there's constantly like interesting stuff to sort of do as you're just running around the map which i think is good design that you actually get distracted by that they're not far away. I need to, need to use dash more to get to our location. Ah! Leave me alone. What did I do to you? Diablo fought on console yet? Yeah, you can grab it from the link down below in the description. If you want to grab it on console. Depending which version you get down there, you can really play. Okay, so in this... You can't do that here. You can't do that here. I'm being attacked. How dare. All right, we've got to go and speak to the, the leader of the village. Over there. Captain Anchors. What do you need? Prava sent me. I'm looking for Vigo. You and that nuisance of a child both. Girl's been nagging us about that demon woman all week. Vigo's gone, looking into her claims. He should be at the mining camp north of here. All escort of knights went missing there last week. Along with the girl's mother and another woman. Watch yourself out there. You watch yourself. Alright, let's go to the mining camp and do this quest. Uh, okay, so... Abilities. I will do my next skills. I think I want to get Shadow Step next. Put that over here. So now, shadow steps gonna allow me to become unstoppable, so we can't get interrupted and quickly move through the shadows to stab your victim from behind. We have such movement now, such movement. And next, I'm just gonna max out twisting blades. Everything's gonna go into that. Then when we've maxed that, we'll just go nuts. Uh, so we gotta go over here to the mine, the knights and the magpie. Hmm. You can use gamepad on PC, can you? Didn't actually know that. sold my stuff at that place because we're going to go down to the mines now more strangers in the camp can't trust any of us can you hello there Vigo are you Vigo I was sent <coughs> She had horns like a beast. Strode right past where you stand. To think my mother's trapped in there with her. 
you let my mother through, sir. Shouldn't you be responsible for her safety? We have soldiers stationed inside. You should be worried about them, too. Maybe you can help me. She looked past me, right? What brings you to Yasna? My mother and I studied the Haradrim. We were onto something big. But then she ran off. It's not like her to abandon the hunt. Hmm. Why are these mines sold off anyway? Nah, mines are closed on church orders. They're not safe. Especially not for children. Shut up, Vega. I was not asking. <sighs> All right, Vega, it's your turn to talk now. Reverend Mother sent me. She did. The Horn Woman is the demon Lilith. No, that can't be. My mother taught me that name. You speak of the Daughter of Hatred. Did Prava mention me? She wasn't angry, was she? She's very disappointed in There's you, Vega. more than your job at stake here. Uh, come on. Let's get this over with. Video is an absolute wuss, isn't he? Come on, man. Open the door. Quickly. Oh, there's a big treasure chest up here. How do I get up there? All through here. Where is she going? There's tons of enemies here. It's locked. Uh, whispering. Where do I get that? The one nearby? The damn hoist is stuck. We've got to go on foot. Damn it. Look out! Look out! More enemies. We. Hey, that's my mother's charm on your wrist. It's mine now, girl. She gave it to me when I let her and her friend pass through. A bribe? <laughs> yeah. Ah. This guy. Good old Vigo. Such a bandit of a guard. I love it. Robbing the locals. I gotta kill these guys. Right? Oh, I need more time. It's this tiny thing here. This class is so rapid. Give me some rocks. Open Vigo. Close. The game has in-game trading. Oh, does it? Does Maybe it have like? We should go back. Round up the knights. And leave my mother in Lilith's care for as long as that will take? No. I'm going on. This is one bold child. I like it. Let's go. Into the into the mines full of demons. I like your enthusiasm. I think long term the game's gonna be good. Hopefully. I'm out of energy. Oh, Strider shoes. Give him, give him, give him. Look at all these undead skeletons. Direct sun. An empty bag of hopelessness. Don't worry, guys. I'll clear the room of all the enemies. No problem. Jesus, I'm so quick, it's ridiculous. No lift. The jam must be deeper down. Of course, it's at the bottom. 
Are they going to add Paladin to the Crusader? I assume, yeah, in time. I don't know when they will. Like, it would make sense for them to eventually add, like, the Amazon, the Paladin, and the Crusader. I really want to play the Hammerdin again from uh, Diablo Immortal. Diablo 2. Stone Calm. You will die. Yeah, future development state of the part of the game. Makes sense. Into the next area we go. Any bugs or crashes yet? No bugs, no crashes. I know there's one graphical error on some blood in the intro cutscene, um, which was probably not noticed by anyone else but me, but that was it. Probably a Nvidia issue, to be honest. <laughs> Make a jump and have a look at this upgraded stuff we have hopefully which does less damage disgusting why am i even carrying this rare gloves let's go we i don't know what happened to my companion they seem to have left me oh here they are waiting for me to go through this door the condemned mines I mean, the story's good so far. I'm enjoying it. What do you mean by enriched is the question. Inspect the door. What, this door? Locked. Over here. I can squeeze through to the other side. You happy now? Wait, hold on. And there she goes. <laughs> Enemies approaching. Nowhere to go. Fight's coming to us this time. Rex, son. Oh, it's a vampire. I've got it. Oh, thirty six armor, and it's yellow. Let's go. That was quick thinking. Sure. He's impressed. Child intellect OP. Why would your mother leave you like that? She wouldn't. Or she shouldn't have. I'm sure she had good reason. We'll see when we find her. Uh, minus 10. That rogue looks nice. It is very OP. Look at that. Get No one found a chance. Everyone's dead. Easy, let's go. Who's this? Revenant. Yeah, I mean the speed is, is ridiculous. And I'm still kind of getting used to it, to be honest. I need more time. I need more time. Oh, everyone's already dead. Rifter of Two, is it any good? I'm not Unlocks... dying here. Unlocks a new look if you salvage them. Maybe I should do that. Ah! I properly just stood under that. But it's good to see that you actually get knocked down and it has an effect on you. Over there. An opening. Go! I will get shadow of you, yeah. As soon as I can.
We're not high enough level yet. Ego. What's up, my dude? Good. Everyone made it. The tunnel's closed. We're, we're trapped without the hoist. Look, there she is. Your mum? Oh wow, this is some necromancer looking place. Where is she? I can't see her. So I've got dash and shadow stare. Um, I'm just going to continue maxing twisting blaze now until we can get... Um, shadow and beaven is what we want over here. It's quite a way away then. What is it? That statue. It's her. The way I saw her. Lilith. We need to find my mother. Who was digging this mine anyway? Okay, we gotta go back round and down and around. I think you might be right, actually. About the voice actor. Over there, the hoist. Where is it? The hoist. Oh, at last, I'll ride out. We're staying oh, here. Right no problem. A slave. What happened? <sighs> we need reinforcements. No, I am. We can. <clears throat> what was that? It came from beyond the gate. He's very keen to check that out. I'll open it, don't worry. Whoa. No. The escort. They're all dead. <laughs> Over there. He's fine. It's just a flesh wound. Who did this? A woman. Vigo. It was one of the women you sent. Only. She wasn't human. She, she was a demon. Like the statue. And claim she mothered sanctuary. <laughs> it was a damn bloodbath. The other woman, Venard, where is she? <sighs> she begged for her life. <laughs> well, I spared her. Let her deeper in. <sighs> Give up, girl. <laughs> She's lost. Vigo, you must listen. Steel did nothing. Oh, 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 spells, prayers, all useless. Go to Corvara. Tell Pro. Raise the army. The father. Evil itself. Mox sanctuary. The prayers didn't work. Do this for me. He is dead. I'm done for. Your mother told me this trinket would bring good fortune. To think I trusted her. She bribed you with it, didn't she? You weren't supposed to let her through at all. But it's not too late. She can still be saved. Vigo. Not by me. Not anymore. Prava will know what to do. You're leaving us? Abandoning her? There's nothing left to abandon. She's good as dead. I'm sorry, kid. He really just left us. It's up to us now. You have a hard opinion about it. My dude. I don't know, I'm giving it a chance, the story for sure. I've quite enjoyed um, what I've played so far. Lilith can't be too far. 
Lith showed me the ugly truth of our cosmos, the eternal conflict. Angels and demons have battled over control of creation for all time. To what end? I asked. She simply laughed. She was like, heh. That's good banter. What is this? It's another vision. Inspect. How your mind races. Yes, I am Lilith, mother of sanctuary. Daughter of hatred. I have what you seek. You hunger for knowledge. You dragged your child all over Sanctuary in pursuit of it. No, I... I taught her how to survive. Is that what you want to believe? Oh dear. Drop the act. You have questions. I have answers. I know the fabric of the cosmos. Everything I've read has warned me against you. You've read so much, yet know so little. Will you accept my offer? I... I don't know. Will you let me try? I want to try. A trap. Your mother is alive. She came this way with Lilith. How can you be sure? Uh, sometimes I see visions of the past. I saw them. What? How? Lilith's petals. Her blood was fed to me once. Trust me. They're in safe hands. Mm. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I'm trapped in a cave with this weird guy. Some. Forbidden. Lilith saw a way to escape the eternal conflict. She tells me it started with the seduction of the angel Inarius. All this time, he was just as fallible as any man. Damn. She just says she seduced him. That's cold. Yeah, that's quite powerful. Lilith is, sanctuary. Lilith is Sanctuary's mother. Somehow, I felt the truth of it the moment she said it to those knights. Now I know how. She used Inarius to craft this world, a refuge from the eternal conflict. I like how this kind of explains the story to you, even if you've not played Diablo before. I need more time. Kind of cool. I need more energy. I need more energy. Need more time. The firstborn. All my life I've sought the origin of humankind. It was always her. From the union of, union of angels and demons came the first generation of humanity. They were powerful. They were powerful. Movers of mountains. Shakers of seas. Lilith sounds familiar. Oh, really? Where have you heard her before? Need more time. Die, Shaman. What is this? Oh, I can do it. A little viewpoint. Let's have a look at the view. It's the Necromancer's Black Lake. And there's some markings on the ground there in the middle. Kind of like these little zoom viewpoints the game has. Plus one Demon's Heart. My favourite. Can't I open this door? Yeah. Suspicious. One of there's something good behind it. Yeah, I feel like uh, Diablo 3 
to Diablo 4. Obviously, it's been many years since I played Diablo 3. But oh, they haven't there. taken as many risks with this game on, like... <laughs> like if you look at looter shooter games, um, they kind of, like, have added lots of different boss mechanics and things that make the encounters more engaging, like, time limits. But most of the bosses, from what I played in the beta, just seem to be a DPS check. Um, can you kill it fast enough with the health potions it gives you and so on? Um, so, yeah, I kind of agree with you. I feel like they could have taken more risks with this. And I hope when they introduce new content to the game that they do that. Because I feel like that's that that would be a step in the right direction. Rathma. She was so proud in tell the telling of this part. Lilith and Inaris bore a son together. Rathma. He is wise beyond his years. The first to untangle the power of necromancy. She says his lair lies deeper within. This is Rathma down here. There's a little picture of him. Let's go inside. Into Rathma's lair. Another vision. So curious. You are eager to know why you were spared. Yes. Do you have faith in me? I... want to. Good. For now, all you need know is that we are going to meet my son. Rathma, the first necromancer. He is that, and more. He is the key to my plans. I, yeah, I agree like with you, Drush. Searching for Lilith's son, Rathma. Together. That's what they said. Mother, what are you thinking? She's an idiot. Open Sasami. That's all this then. That's all this then. Erect. Oh, just destroyed it. Uh, where do we want to go? I'm going to go this way. I have a good feeling about this direction. Oh, is that our first legend? No, it's actually a rare, isn't it? It's a rare. We have a ring as well. And this is plus 90 with some different resistances. It's kind of cool. How much money will we have to spend to make my character look cool, do you think? Or do you think that the armor in the game is going to be, like, cool enough? I think the barbarian armor is pretty cool. So far, the rogue's like, right, I look like a rogue, which is good. But, like, what's the next step, though? Can I be bothered to go back to 13 gold? No. Ow! My neck. I just tank these rocks like they're nothing. Ooh, hello. Big damage. Oh, get me away. He's summoning me. Definitely into the story of this one. Yeah, I found the story quite compelling. The voice acting is good. It carries itself. Good so far, for sure. Chalk scribblings on stone tablet. Lilith opened my eyes to the crimes of Inaris. He betrayed her. Banished her. He sapped the power of her children. He's the reason we're weak. The reason we die. He's ruined us because he feared us. We'll show him that he has a right what? to be afraid. What? Yep. Big plot twist. 
I can kind of understand her perspective there. Need more time. Get wrecked. I love how we can so easily make everything vulnerable that we come across. Pretty powerful. We've almost looped everything around, I think. Just going back on myself. I need more time. I need more time. Oh, wait. Oh, we should have gone this way. Damn it. I went left instead of right. What brand is my mouse? Uh, this is a Razer mouse. It's the Cyberpunk edition. It's yellow. You can't see it. It's the Cyberpunk Razor Mouse. Um, yeah, it's pretty good. I, I don't really like... I'm not ready. I usually go for the mouse that looks cool. I wouldn't say, even though I used to like do a lot of competitive gaming with like League of Legends and stuff, like I wouldn't say it really matters that much. Most mice these days have pretty good DPI. And that's all you need to worry about. Just get yourself a good mouse, mouse bat and a mouse and you're good to go. more time. I find that the the mice and keyboards the razor are good. I've had experience with. Ah, this is the big room. Yeah, deleted. And then we gotta go down here. Through the next door. With another vision, I suppose. Oh, blocked again. Does Lilith know we're coming? Oh, what? What the hell just happened? I missed the vision. No. Oh no, it's here. What the hell? The game just teleported me to the back of the room to defeat the boss, I guess. It's not ready. You've mastered your fear. But I still sense your pain. You miss your daughter. My magpie. She's scared right now. She must be. Go. Or stay. It is time to choose. I... I trained her well. She's a good kid. Strong. She'll be all right, she... You've chosen well, my child. Terrible. Terrible. To reach Rathma, we will need to cross a lake at the bottom of these ruins. It requires a ritual. I will teach you. As you wish, mother. She's like, Abra, Kadabra, and then the Good. door's like, open sesame. Ready for lesson one. Blood is the key. Oh, yeah. Spicy. What did you see this time? I don't need sparing. Tell me. You need to cut yourself. Lilith plans to teach your mother a ritual. One that needs blood. Your mother seemed receptive. We you have like to that. reach them. Your mum was receptive to the blood sacrifice. She was like, yeah, sign me up. Let's go. I'm ready. Take my blood. Needs the blood of a human to cross the necromancer lake, I guess, which uh, Lilith can't do because she is a demon. Oh, what's this? The violent pants. Nice panties. Who's this? Some more dead enemies. We need to level up, then. Uh, what's this? Die. Right. So I got some new pants, a new sword. And a better dagger. 
another point in twisting blades. So we can get over here. Direct, May. Just line them up, knock them all down like skills. That's the great thing about this still. I need more time. I need more time. Where did Lilith go there? That is the question. Die. Not ready yet. Not ready yet. He definitely wasn't ready for that attack. I'll tell you that much. You weren't. You weren't able to connect last night. Yeah, this is exactly why I didn't play at launch. Like there was no way I was gonna like be able to log on. To be honest. Come at me, boys. This is the way. I'm here, stop reviving people. Disgusting statement. Oh, 250 crit. Can't wait until that's like half a million. Get the way we need to go. Why won't you die, Overseer? Here we are. This barrier. It looks like the same kind of magic as before. Use your blood, child. Demons approach. We need to get through. I think I can dispel it. Hurry up. Demons and stuff. Oh, I have more demons. Need more time. The enemies have more than one death end. Well, I guess usually they just explode into uh, blood, right? I don't know what more you want from that. Like, it's the Diablo. Sometimes they get sliced in half, I guess. I mean, it sounds cool and looks cool to me, so... It's all I care about. Nice one, kid. Might keep you around if you're this useful. Nothing here. <laughs> See you later. I'm filling out an invoice. <laughs> what, for work or for to invoice someone to get Diablo? Chalk scribblings? How sweet this taste. Lilith asked me to aid in the ritual sacrifice. A priest from the escort. He had no fight. He just prayed as we all made his blood useful. Forgive my hand, I am shaking. Power dances along my bones. I walk the path of our maker now. Nice one, brother. There's a shortcut out of the mine here. Not enough blood. Never enough blood. Hello? I will follow you to the ends of sanctuary, mother. Oh, this is the priest. A dead priest. A huge gash across his neck drained him of blood. A priest. He must be from the escort Vigo sent. Indeed. Oh, he's been drained dry. What has she done? That's a lot of there chalk. He is. She ran out of chalks and now she's using blood. Nice. Your mum's crazy, girl. Yo. Go ahead, I'll have your back. <laughs> Ryan, thanks for becoming a battle brother of the channel. Appreciate you, my dude. 
Mother? Nirel? You're just in time. Beyond this lake lies the necropolis of the Firstborn. A trove of magic and knowledge. I opened the way for Lilith. But I could not pass through with her. I... I lack divine element, you see. Stop. But I can find it. I'm so close. I simply need... Mother, stop! Look at what Lilith has done to you. You're writing in your own blood. My little magpie. She awakened me. She showed me things... I can't even put into words. Once I've finished, you will understand. I don't care what she showed you. Please, let's just get out of here. <laughs> oh, I see. Yes, clever magpie. Trying to lead me away so you can take all this for yourself. Hmm? <laughs> this is my discovery, not yours. Jesus. I will finish these rooms with your blood! Oh. You must stop this! Please, Mum, no. Look at the gifts she's given me. She's immune to damage. Come back here. I can't even go that way. Oh, hello. Gotta dodge these things. Ow. Didn't really dodge that very successfully, did I? Come back over here, you stupid succubi. I'll kill her, don't worry. We'll see about that, won't we, witch? Oh, lots of magic. Get wrecked, succubus. Ah. Uh. Cool boss fight. Uh, it was harder and better for sure. Grab this health potion. Kill her! Get her while she's weak, child. Oh my god, it's a big demon. I need more time. Get out of here. Give me those health potions. I don't even need them. Back over here. Just me. Need some more energy. Ah. I think she's dead. Oh no, she's still dying. Okay, I think she's dead. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry about. Sorry about that. <laughs> you were. You were protecting me. I don't want to hate you. I'm trying. I really am. We're going to make Lilith pay for what she's done. So 
So we need blessed blood. Go back to your brother. Get that blessing. Beg if you need to. Whatever it takes. My mother started this damn ritual. I'm going to finish it. Meet me in the Mistral Woods. I will meet you in the forest, right child. The Haradrim hid a vault there. Finding it was her life's work. So much for that. Maybe it will help with the ritual. If not, at least I can bury her where she'd want. I need time. I'm sorry. Just leave me. And we've leveled up. Worth. Killing her mum to level up? I'll do it any day. So now we've got to go back to the... Oh, you got a spicy dagger! What's this? Boom. I like it. Okay. Now we need to get blessed blood. Pretty easy to do. Is the game any good or is there any pay to win elements? I mean, there's a cosmetic item shop where you can only buy cosmetics. I guess the only pay to win thing currently would be that you can pay more to buy the game and play earlier than other people. Um, so I guess it, if you have a bigger wallet in that sense, you'd be at an advantage. But at the same time, like, I mean, you can just play at launch and I don't really think it makes any difference um, in my personal opinion. So, I have one skill point. Let's put it in Twisting Blades again. Even more damage. Damage. Maximum damage. Let's go. Yeet. Yeet. More enemies. Oh, fuck. Oh. I've got to go out the entrance over here somewhere. Need to get some blessed blood. Or BRB. To get my blessed blood. I think we can use the lift now as well. Exiting. That's how you exit. Skill points? Yes. She has the book of the dead for sure. I think she was trying to get Remus Staff out. Which way? something going on here so we have to go back to the cathedral don't know where the ne nearest fast travel point is anyway lots of blood get wrecked son so these are the lowlands What's going to be faster, for me just to go straight back, or to the north, or what? Let's go this way. What time is it? Um, I think there's a world boss in 15 minutes. We could even try that. Just as a fun little thing to do. I'm sure it was like around here somewhere. And then right. A wraith? Disgusting. What's going on here then? A bunch of wraith summoning. Ooh, what's this? What is Still... this? Not seen that before. Of a timer. We'll do the world boss, yeah? And now we play. Dude, that's the fire made ultimate there. Look at it. The Rexham. What do you have for me? So let's see what that was. Uh, Adriot Helm. Okay, this was the sealed aspect. Cannot salvage. Can I even open it? Oh, 
I'm not ready yet. I think we have to discover it and then it might show us the timer. Great gameplay, actually loving it. Really glad to hear. It's level 25 plus, but I've killed this thing really low level before. With the help of other players, obviously. Soloed it. Apparently there's no wild boss marker. Does anyone remember how you get the marker to tell you when it's going to spawn? I want to come back and do that on this stream. I really do hope so as well. I think Bethesda can't afford to, for time. it not to be good. To be I think they have a lot riding on the game. Being good. Another event over here too. Have a look. Is someone there? It's me. Yes, yes. Sir. I'm here to save you. I'm not ready. Get wrecked. Do you need help? Please. I need your help. I can't see. My dearest wanders these woods alone. Oh, Jesus. Yes. Tons of graceful phantoms coming after him for some reason. And I've got to protect him. Let's see. A tactical skeleton, eh? Have you found what you're looking for, my dude? Need more time. Are you still there? I'm right here, my dude. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, we're going to go back over here in a second. I just wanted to take another route round. Can you play Chivalry 2? I have played Chivalry 2 ages ago. I do enjoy the game, it's very good. Maybe we'll jump on and do some more fun content around it sometime. Right now, I'm very busy with the Avalo. Friend? Try not to leave. What's he gonna dig up? Some ancient thing? I need to kill? Oh, something's happening now. Where are you? I'm right here, my dude. Stop moaning. So is the game good? Oh yeah, so far, like, fantastic. Really good story and everything. Give me your chest of fine wares. What is this? It's a sword with plus four. I'll take it. Angrily. Okay, so I'm going to go into this little corner thing here. Oh, dude. That damage is just beautiful. I really need to sell my stuff. I'm carrying too much expense to this. Oh, healing bolt. Nice. Oh, what's this? There's tons of frozen people here. Need more time. 
time. Yeah, Rex. Level 13. What do we want next? Another point in spinning blades, and then we can start investing in a bit more survivability. Yes, I need more Look time. at this pace. No one can keep up with this class. It's insane. People say Starfield's got Mass Effect uh, RPG elements. I mean, I hope so. It's a roleplay game. I think it'll be like a Bethesda game in space, honestly. Would you recommend to buy Diablo? Yeah, 100%. I'm really enjoying the gameplay. This is definitely like something I love to play this sort of game. So for me, it's it's great. You know, I knew I was going to enjoy it going into it. It's very much like Diablo 3 in that sense. Um, and the reviews are very good too. You grab it from the link below if you do want to play. As for whether you get the more expensive version to play earlier, it's something really up to you. Okay, almost background. I've covered a bunch of the map here. Hello there. Hello. Oh, give me the iron. more time almost there I don't think I could actually walk across the river it needs time to recharge Deleted. Not in town. Not in town. Alright, now he's going to speak to the grand lady to tell her that we have done her bidding and everything's gone wrong. It looks like a mobile game. Why do people keep saying that? Is it because it's top down? Have you never seen a top down game before? Diablo was the thing before mobile games. Mobile games are probably based on the, the general idea and gear progression to get people to buy stuff and monetize it. See that the kitchen is ready for the morrow service. Angels above. You've returned. It's me. I need a holy blessing to continue chasing Lilith. The Reverend Mother will want to hear of this, but she's away at Corvalar. Seek your blessing there. Everything is unfolding as Inarius foretold. Soon, he will be free to escape sanctuary and return to the heavens where he belongs. You say so? Inarius foretold this. He was given a prophecy. Light piercing hatred's heart, it said. He knew what it meant, that he was fated to kill Lilith. And when he does, he will be redeemed, and he will ascend to the heavens once more. Morning, John. How's it going? What time is it in the USA where you are? Where is Corvalar? One of our defenses against the prime evils. We fight terror with faith. Hatred with compassion. We've built the mighty towers at Corvalar to withstand destruction. Hmm, how's that going for you? What do you know of the Reverend Mother Prava? As a girl, she was sick. Plagued by constant seizures. But Enarius healed her. When I met her, I was a sinner. But her faith showed me what I could be. You naughty man. There's no one better fit to lead us. Very well. I'll take your word for it. So now we need to go over here. Damn it. Or could we go over here? One sec. Level 13. That's level 13 T. I think we'll go here first. Do this quest. To get blessed. Become blessed before we progress to the other stuff.
I actually need to do these little side quests as well before we go because we want to upgrade our health potion. Otherwise, when we level up, we won't be able to heal ourselves as effectively. I need more time. I need more time. We also need to sell our stuff as well. Let's go and do the side quest about upgrading items quickly. Almost 9 a.m. Oh, an early start. I want to upgrade my equipment. Let's have a look at you, hmm? Hmm. Buckles need reinforcing. This leather's cracked. What have you been getting yourself into, huh? Look, you live or die by the quality of your equipment. If you've the coin and materials, I can improve it for you. Very well. So we can deconstruct stuff now. Uh, or we can obviously just carry on selling it. Oh, is this all better than my current one? One iron chunk, one silver chunk. One raw hide. So I think we'll deconstruct the stuff that was worth anything for now. Transmog also gets unlocked by what you deconstruct, which is good to know. I need to replace my dagger with this. It's just more powerful. Uh, I'm gonna sell the rest of the stuff. Well struck. Raise the father. And right now, we're not really focused on making much gold. Uh, we want to upgrade our potions. This is the most important thing to do. Uh, I want to increase the potency of my healing potion. Well, you certainly have the look of someone who spends a lot of time in the wilds. I expect you'll also want some of my elixirs, but let's focus on your healing potion for now. I have some extra materials we can use this time. If you want to improve your healing potion further or craft any elixirs, you'll need to source your own ingredients. I'll not leave these walls. Never again. Oh, okay. The potency of your healing potion can be upgraded at the Alchemist. Yes. Uh, earn Renown to increase the potency. Cool. Okay, so let's upgrade to Tiny Healing Potion. We've got enough Gallo Vine that I collected earlier with you guys. Then when we get to level 20, we just need one more Gallo Vine and we can already upgrade that as well. We can also craft elixirs, which give us mega damage. Um, and materials can also be crafted here as well. Okay, so I need to go over here is where I want to go next. Not in town. Not in town. Why so early in the morning? Because in the UK, we have a different time zone. I wake up in the morning, after a good night's sleep, um, no queuing for servers, and I jumped in the game and started playing and live stream. And uh, yeah, it was fantastic. Really enjoyed it. Very good so far. I can't do that here. Can't do that here. You do what I say, you silly boy. As soon as we pass these posts, boom, super speed engage. Go and do this side quest as we uh, venture north. Do do. We'll be in the spirit zone now. Whoa! How dare! Gold, I'll take it. Don't know why I'm collecting these spirits for. Ow. Yeah. 
Oh, you can actually ignore it if uh, those abilities, if you time that backstab ability at the right time. Pretty nice. Who's this priest? Oh, he's dead. Sorry about that, man. Jesus. Didn't really want to kill him. It is done. I need more time. I've done this little quest for a or whatever it is, I don't know. Let's actually do this um, event as well before we go over to the destination. This event's pretty nice for collecting rares, or at least it used to be unless they nerfed it. So we'll go in here and then get loads of kills, basically. Hello there! Where are they? I'll kill them all, don't worry. Oh, some pants. I'll protect this lady for a bit. From some enemies whenever they spawn. Going well, thank you. Been smashing through the avenue this morning. And we are kind of mainly focused on the main story, but right now it's just the side content as well. Watch out, lady. Big boy. I need more time. Big damage. I believe you. I'm not ready. We need it. Easy, there we go. A makeshift bow. That does a lot more damage than my current one. These pants are good. And what's in here? Some murmuring orbs and a nice rare tunic there. That looks pretty nice. Just drop down here and carry on to our little quest objective. I need more time. He needs more time. Oh, get me out of here, man. How do I get down? Get... Oh, no, that's the other side. Uh, do you know the recipe for an, for an enchanting potion? Not off the heart, no. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's why I want to clip him. Yeah. Yeah. I want to go over here. I'm not ready yet. Jump across this road. Are you talking about Skyrim? What about Skyrim? Oh, you mean in Skyrim, what's an enchanting potion recipe? Um, I still don't remember what it is, to be honest with you. Probably done a video about it somewhere, though. Can't reach it. It will go unharvested. I'm not ready yet. We're almost here. To meet up with Mother Prava. If that is her real name. Hopefully there's a boss travel point here too. That would be useful. State your business. My dear. Reverend Mother Prava expects me. Open the gates! Important business. Let me in. You were good soldiers. Worked hard. Fought hard. <laughs> Drank hard too. 
brothers. Sisters. I hope you find peace in these flames. Vigo, what are you doing here? So you lived. I came clean to Prava. About taking that woman's bribe. Ugh, it's looking bad. My ass is on the line. Might not have a job when she's done with me. Hey, you're here for her, right? Let's go together. Maybe she'll go easy on me if you're there. We'll see about that. I'm glad, Amanda, that you found the uh, the videos helpful. That's what I'm here for. Gone the wrong way. Not so helpful. Not many could bear your sins. <laughs> She's mad. Oh. She's expecting us. That is in. Here you go. Good luck. <laughs> You'll need it, bro. Have the new watch commander replace the forces we lost at the mine. So, you've returned. Vigo here tells me you were braver than he. He's not very brave, so this is true. Skolgen is under threat from Lilith. Donin sent a message about it already. Why does Ninarius go there to deal with her? The prophecy says the battle will unfold in hell. That is where the blow must be struck. Thank God for the prophecy. It's cool that you can ask about this, uh, obviously because you couldn't do that other quest we did in the beta. I need a divine blessing to chase Lilith. First, you will be made worthy of a blessing. A holy war cannot be won with faithless troops. Make no mistake. This war is holy. Lilith has brought the eternal conflict to sanctuary. And Inarius will deliver us as writ in prophecy. Until then, we have our parts to play. Make a pilgrimage to the Alabaster Monastery. Cleanse your spirit. Then we may discuss a blessing. Easy enough. You do that. as well make myself useful come by the ruins south of here i shall indeed marcus pointing towards the fabled city of calden quest complete call valor jesus where'd he go i mean okay the ruin's not that far away but he just disappeared my boy was ready to get out of here we need a game of thrones like show this time with a better ending. Are they not doing another sort of Game of Thrones spin-off or something? Not in remember. town. I would like to see that. Dude, this place is massive. I need more time. How's the game so far? Really good so far. Really enjoying it. Definitely some good quests. Playing on the rogue is my main this time. Which I'm also enjoying Hail. like the character's playstyle. What must I do for the pilgrimage? There's a shrine west of here. There's a relic. I'm told it takes on your sin, weighs you down, body and soul, beats the hell out of you. It'll cleanse you, prepare you to stand before the Father. Very well. I hope you don't have many regrets, friend. This kind of thing is a lot deadlier for some than others. Watch out, all right? I'll find the, you at the end. The map is very much open world now. Like, the zones are huge in comparison. What else can you tell me about the pilgrimage? Nothing good. <laughs> Lost more than a few worthy soldiers to it. But it'll clean you up for Inarius. Rare honor for an outsider. <laughs> if you can call it that. Get to meet Inarius after all of this. You're not coming with me? Ah, uh, no. I'm not ready, not by a long shot. Even if I could survive the trail, there's no telling what would happen in the end. You, though, you have a solid chance. Do you believe in the Cathedral's prophecy? I had my doubts. 
The priests were always going on about the return of Lilith. But now she's here. Just like they said. I'd say um, the rogue is the best boss class for leveling. Because uh, of how I'm building it. Um, a lot of undead enemies. And just like for moving as well, it's ridiculous. I think that currently, unless they probably nerf it, which I think they will, is the Barbarian Whirlwind build is tier 1 for endgame. Rogue is going to be like mostly about survivability. You can definitely do ridiculous damage on this class, and you can kill bosses like they're nothing. Hello there! Need more time. Oh, so satisfying. Where are you off to me? Not over there, am I? Alright, what else do we need to do? Destroy enemy structures. There's another one in here, apparently. That clear is, is beautiful. It just feels so good. There's supposed to be a show about Jon Snow. He doesn't know anything about it. I'm sure. Is there any more structures here? Just two big boys. So where is the final structure? Up here, I see. doing a bow rogue. Bow rogues are decent, they're just not as good for leveling. Yeah, Rexon. Oh, a saber? What's this about? Plus 50 damage. We'll take we take those, we take those. Said. Let's continue on now. We've done this little event. I need more time. I need more time. Yes. To the first part of the shrine. Batman like the dark, I hear. Oh, where we can level up now. What am I going to get next? We are level 14. So I think I'm going to go for Dark Shroud. Oh, I've actually unlocked this as well. So this is what I want to get. It's Dark Shroud. Surround yourself with up to 5 protective shadows. Gain 8% damage reduction per active shadow. 20 second cooldown. I'm going to put that on number one. Uh, and eventually I will come back and max that. But um, right now, it's just going to be a bit more survivable. We just don't ever die. <laughs> Looks cool too. Need more time. Right, this is the shrine. Heart creature of darkness, for you have wandered beyond the reach of the light. Lift your sins, breathe deep the cold air. The path to redemption lies before you, if you have the faith to walk it. I will retrieve it. Now we have to go to the next objective down there. 
while getting killed and carrying this tome. Yes. Taking like 30 seconds together. It needs time to recharge. It needs time. Get out of here, mate. Get out of here. Deletes us. Anyone else want some? Put the altar statue down. Feel the sting of your wounds. Let the ice into your bones. Welcome your pain. For the agony of the flesh is the first cleansing of the soul. Make your faith stronger than any hurt. So right now, the only pay to win aspects in the entire game are... That's, everything's cosmetic. The only pay to win thing potentially is the fact you can spend more to play the game before the sixth, like I am. Um, that's the only thing that you could be considered pay to win, I guess. Um, but apart from that, there's no experience, potions, or anything like this. Idol of Faith. Let's pick this up again. Yes. Yes. Deleted. Just over here. Got that gallo vine to upgrade our potion after. Easy. But uh, beyond that, they're going to have a battle pass, so obviously time will tell um, what... What's going to happen there, right? Look around at the mountains towering over you. Feel how small you are. Embrace humility. Accept your place in worship to the Father. For he has shown us the way. I, I assume they have gear creep, right? Because that's what all game like MMOs have that. Like, every game has that, like... Because otherwise you just, like, you get the best gear in the game and then you just stop progressing. So I assume that they'll have, like, some kind of gear creep to encourage people to carry on engaging with the content. Whether, because they said that everything would just be cosmetic. Like, that's what was the promise. So I don't know how the battle pass would work. That's the only thing I don't know. That remains to be seen. Can I only go off what they said? Oh, there's a big boy here. Delete it because this is great. Ow. The end nears, pilgrim. Look into yourself. Find your faith. Feel how it fills the void within you. Remember, you are nothing without faith. Hold fast to the light and remember. You are nothing. If you don't have any faith, what are you? Nothing. I want to go to a pilgrimage where I just carry a giant, like church relic on my back and place it on different altars around the world. Sounds kind of cool to me. <laughs> cosmetics is no biggie. Yeah, and my god, they do they do charge for those cosmetics. We'll have a look at the shop later, I'm sure. Oh! Rejoice in your faith! The Father is prophesied to redeem us all. A spear of light piercing hatred's heart. When he ascends to the heavens, he shall lift us all with him. The light to be above. That's cool. This is Vigo, isn't it? 
so I like playing cards. Doesn't make me a sinner. But that bribe... Good soldiers died on account of what I did. Is that the kind of man I am? The kind I'll always be. I just... Damn it. I'm praying. Why isn't this working? Huh, you made it. That's the idea of praying. That makes one of us, at least. You heard from Prava? I will. Soon. But enough about that. You're about to meet Father Inarius himself. Not everyone comes back, you know. You'd better. I, I owe you a stiff drink. If our prayers were always answered, I guess it would be a pretty easy life. What is this? Ooh. Ooh, yes. Oh, yes. That is cool. Yeah, I like that. Are you going to do PvP at all? Uh, potentially. I mean, I'd probably stick on a sorcerer if I was going to really do yeah. PvP. I'm not ready yet. Yeah. <laughs> Open sesame. Oh, that sounds bad for destiny. Kneel oh. before him and remember you are small, wonderfully small. Why must I kneel? No, 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 it's not about kneeling, it's about wonder. Oh. The light itself, divinity itself, radiates from that room. Though my flesh is cold and numb, my spirit is warm with reverence. Okay. What can we do but kneel? <laughs> so intense. Couldn't Inarius be at Korval? And so he was. Until the sweet poetry of the prophecy rang out. To divine its message, he pilgrimaged deep into Sanctuary's heart to meet. Uh, well, I shouldn't say. Okay. Meet who? It pains me to withhold the truth of his light. But... I sense it in you, Pilgrim, so I shall tell you. He went to speak with the first of his children, Rathma, the prophecy's true author. He emerged armed with sacred conviction, a holy battle at the center of the prophecy to be won by his blade. He has meditated here for years and years ever since, readying to meet fate head on. I see. How do you know so much about Narius? How do you know the warmth of the sun, the love of your mother, the beauty of a song? His presence is infectious. It takes hold in the soul. We are a void without faith, an empty well. The pious fill their cups with prayer. Mine overflows with his light. So near, so pure. I am changed. I I am nothing. I am better. Isn't it beautiful? Who says so? Doesn't look like a monastery, it looks more like a king's castle. Yeah, that is very Anarius though, if you think about it. Like he literally turned himself into a god among people, took their powers for his own and claimed that he was going to be the savior. So yeah, my dude's got a pretty big ego. Let's go and knock on the father's portal of radiance. Here we go. Meeting the big boy himself. 
taking my hood off for this. This is how you choose to approach me. Forgive this intrusion, but... Tell me what you need. I must traverse the Black Lake, and that cannot be done without your blessing. If I've learned anything during my time here, it is that what we're looking for, and what we need, are rarely the same thing. I once thought I could find an end to this war, but there has been no resolution, only more pain. Everything I've done has pulled me further from home, from the place I need to be. This world we made was born from the impossible, and yet, like its creators, it rots from the inside. I... I don't... Lilith has entered the ancient city. With your blessing, I can pursue her. And this world has been wasted on the crusades of the unworthy. I can stop her. Hmm. This audience is concluded. I am too cool for you, brother. <laughs> Put my hood back on in depression. Love it. Back to Kovala. Meow. Can zoom through the castle now. I need more time. I wish they had Stourum in this game. Meow. Inaris didn't seem very welcoming. No, no, no. You heard him, but you did not listen. His voice is music, a symphony of light. Look beyond the words themselves, and you will find truth. I see. Yeah. Why does my character make that sound when I dodge? Just like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Sometimes, okay, he doesn't do it all the time, just sometimes, it's funny. I need more time. Maybe I'll do it next time. Oh no, that was a roll. I need more time. I need more time. There it is, that. That is, what is that sound? So weird. Give me these iron chunks and stuff. Then we can go back over here. Wish there was a fast travel portal, or we can unlock our horse soon, at least. It needs time to recharge. Okay. I should really turn off those notifications. was a chest. Cheeky chest. I need more time. Charge. Yeah. Right, almost back. It's night time. Very spook. I need more time. You're the, you're the assassin that says, Nyeh! <laughs> Blessed are those who bask in the light. 
Let our faith be our armor against the encroaching darkness. It's a cool little gathering. Reverend Mother, I have returned. Ah, you've returned. Yes, Come. I have returned. Let us speak inside. Out of the cold. I'm coming. Oh no, we'll go inside. She doesn't want to speak to me until we're inside. Oh no, are we speaking inside now? Okay. This is fine. Why is Narius here on Sanctuary? Penitence. In the heaven's eyes, creating humanity was a sin. They cast him down. Now he seeks redemption and the chance to go home. As prophesied, slaying Lilith is that chance. When he ascends, so shall we all. I'm looking forward to see how this actually plays out. What will become of Vigo? Vigo and I had a good conversation when he returned. He will do his penance. Trust that he is in good hands. What does the prophecy say? From the Father's voice to my ears. A spear of light piercing hatred's heart. First Lilith. Then the Primes. He will deliver us from the eternal conflict. Inarius refused to bless me, though. Yet you stand before me unscathed. I know his ways. That is approval enough for me. In the name of the Light, I bless you. May the Light flow through you and keep you from corruption and sin. Our victory is prophesied in the heavens. The light's protection. Okay, so now we've got this quest we can do, or we can go back down here and do Wayward. I think we'll do that. Then I'm on uncovered territory that I've not explored before. There's a dungeon here. Engineering aspect. Don't need that. Blech. So far away. I need more time. I need more time. It's not ready yet. We're level 82 and legendary. An impressive feat. Give me my silver ore. Get wrecked, son. I'm not ready yet. Here we go. Not much further. Out of these dark, snowy mountains. How much is this game? I've linked it down below in the description. I can't actually remember how much it is in dollars, though. Depends what edition you get off the game, to be honest. I 
What's in here? There's a bunch of undead. I'm not ready. Still 15 monsters within three seconds. You're saying I haven't done that before? It's disgusting. Is that enough monster kills? There at this forbidden forest. Not much further to go. Behold the truths that lie within. Let's quickly level up. So, right now... I think... Level up with 15, Dark Shroud. We want... Enhanced Dash, and then Discipline Dash next. And then Shadow Embiement. Enemies damaged by dash takes 20% increased critical strike damage. Nice. There is something strange going on here. Let's go and be nearby. find her. How to make a successful YouTube channel. Could speak at length on that subject. I would say the best thing to do is to find a niche that you have to be excited about, otherwise you burn out and give up. And then just make content that you enjoy and that people find useful and even search for. Like write down content that you're watching and are interested in. And then um, when you're watching that content, write down like break down the video and what is actually happening in that video. Um, and how it's spoken about. And think about how you could make it shorter, more effective, or more interesting. And then try and niche down as much as possible. And then grow out of that niche, which is kind of what I did with Skyrim. I think that approach still works in this day and age as well. Where the hell am I meant to be going here? Search. She's somewhere in this wood. Just somewhere. Oh, hello. Okay, so what's this? Minus 16, plus 8. Cool. Where are you, Mayril? Somewhere. This is a dead end. No, it does loop around. Is this loop around? No, I think this could be the way we need to go. You think I would need a computer, what, for being a YouTuber? I mean, these days, people can do it on a console, but I think it's much more effective to do it on a computer. 
You're stuck in an illusion created by the Horadrim. The portal will lead you through this crude trap. Why would I trust you, talking dog? Fiery portal? Yes, please, sign me up. Relax. No harm will come to you here. It's my spirit wolf. We saw him in the intro. Blooded wolf. Who are you? Who are you? An admirer of sorts. I saved you in the mountains. You'd lost your horse and crawled into that cave. Would have frozen to death if not for me. Why are you helping me? Oh, it's very simple. You want to stop Lilith, and I want you to succeed. But you'll never do that by following the Horadrim. We don't know anything about the Blooded Wolf, do we really? Their path always ends in fire and death. This is like... Enough. Open the door. He's basically showing us the future of what will happen if we fail. Why are you telling me all of this? Why are you telling me all this? To warn you. A day will come when the Haradrim stumble. Don't be there when they do. The portal will lead you to that little girl you're looking for. <laughs> Been waiting for 23 years to catch you live. What do you mean? Jesus Christ. Good day from Australia. Good day, mate. Oh, I really want to visit Australia. Mm, mate, this place looks creepy. What is this place, anyway? Tristram. The Horadrim of old imprisoned Diablo, the Lord of Terror beneath the earth. And then they built this town nearby. <laughs> you can see how that turned out. Yep. The Astro Nerd Boy, thank you for the donation. You were in a version of Tristram, right? What do you mean? Well, like here, right now. Why do you want to stop Lilith? You're not going to tell us that, is he? I like the world the way it was. Without Lilith. Her little game of rebellion will only lead to chaos. You've already seen visions of the damage she can do. Yes, I know you were fed her blood. Do you feel it? changing you. Perhaps not yet, but as long as Lilith walks in your world, it is only a matter of time. Adam, my dude, what, what is going on? The world has gone to madness. Truly. Back in the Haradrim's illusion. Indeed we are. Abdel. What's up, dude? How's it going? Don't worry, I'll save you from the illusion. Back in the, in the illusion. Oh, here she is. There you are. I think I've lost my way. The same thing happened to my mother and me earlier on. The trail to the vault ends here, so it should be somewhere around in these woods. For sure. Let's find the vaults. Don't die near L. Is it out already? If you get the addition from the Someone link below, you can play us. early. One 
frozen boy. Iraq son. Where has he gone? Just disappeared. Ah, it's this sus tree again. Oh, the original town music from Diablo 1, yeah. Amazing. I see. The path is different now. The statue was the source of an illusion. We must keep that. Indeed we must. Finally, the Herodric Vault. Into the vault we go. The Oblivion Gate, yes. Yes, yeah, so you said Bow Rogue is weak. Uh, it's just not the best, the fastest way to level. This class, uh, the way I'm building it with spinning blades, is much faster. I'll write the whole build in the description below uh, after the video, um, so you can just follow what skill to get on each level. Is this the place? Is this the place? Not what I expected, but let's not give up hope. All we need is one book, one spell, to help us cross the Black Lake and stop Lilith. Wolf, if you can show your face in your YouTube channel. Um... <sighs> Sealed shut. What of the passage over there? Let me check for you. Uh, I think it's cool to show your face. I think it helps in the future having, like, a recognizability of, like, oh, this guy makes good, reliable tips and tricks or guides or, like, funny videos. And then you already have that, like, recognition from people when you show your face. You have like an element of trust there. If you build that trust early on by showing your face, then it can be good. Um, but obviously, there's like extra effort to record with your face, and some people aren't comfortable doing it. I found the book Less Averse Incantations. A worn book, it says. Cool. Here's your one book. Open magic door now. This is. I think it's written in Horodric code. And here. The same symbol on the door. Magic. Symbol. I have an idea. You might want to take a step back. I'll stand right here, thanks. Chess beast shot. See, nothing to worry about. I relied on you. I trusted you and your uh, your abilities. Let's keep on. Let's go, let's go. I wish Mother was here. She's not, she's dead. She betrayed you and slit you, almost. Almost chopped your hand off. How do we get through this door? Use magic, please. Where are you? Come here. Magic. Open the door. It's the same seal as before. Exactly. Should be easy enough to break it again. But why would someone use it here? One way to find out. Of course. We can't let anything stop our pursuit of Lilith. I'll open the door, and if we split up, we'll work faster that way. Only if you stay on this side of the door. Fine. What now we can use for? her magic. Don't you know? A book, a scroll, or anything that will help us cross the Black Lake. Chespeath Chat! Okay. Magic. It works. We're in. Let's go, boys. Let's find the demons from within. Last time I showed my face, my mom cried. What are you? Well, like, on YouTube, I've Demons. Die. 
Ooh, she has a rare item. Nice. Not actually found any legendary items yet, but never, the, the, never mind. We'll find them eventually. I'm sure. I'm sure it's going to be in the north, but I'm going to clear this anyway. Yeah, definitely not down there. You still alive? He's dead now. Nah, just in public. Okay. Bit brutal. Bit brutal. Here we are. Alright. Don't know where this portal actually goes. Ooh. Hello, Herald of Lilith. Ow. It's a bit painful. Direct. I'm not ready yet. of the fire orbs. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my gosh, push me into it. God damn it, insane. Ah. Here, destroy the fireballs. Ow. That would have killed me. Come here. Or not. Stop hanging out in central system. This tome you have, Death Harness Theories of Rathma. I was a demon oh. guarding that book. I the should take this back to Nairil. The Necromancer's book. The first Necromancer, yeah. as it were. Take me back home. West Virginia. Thoughts on the game so far, and I have been asked almost a thousand times, you're right. This was actually the 870th time, therefore it's okay for me to respond. I hope you had more luck than me. Yeah, really enjoying the game so far. The story's good. I mean, I've already played through the last two quests we've played through uh, in the beta. But I played through one that I hadn't played through and I enjoyed that. Uh, so I'm kind of excited like, to see where the main story actually goes. Um, it's still compelling to me and interesting to me, so that's good. Um, in terms of the gameplay, yeah, fantastic. Re it's Diablo. They haven't really done anything different compared to Diablo 3 and what was good with that. Um, it will be interesting to see if they push the boat out further or try something different with some of the mechanics as I continue to play through. How's it going, Julian? Good to see you, man. I found this book. Interesting. This ledger was written by the Haradrim. This is chronicling spells and theories created by Rathma, the first necromancer. Indeed, indeed. That's not what we're looking for. No. But it can still work. There must be a spell in this book we can use to bring my mother back. Oh, she God, knows no. the ritual to cross the Black Lake. A mistake I've made. Um, are you sure this is a good idea? It's all we have. My mother will help us through. Meet me down there. 
A big mistake though. We give the necromancer book to the lady who wants to bring back her mum from the dead. Rathma's book. Can't be a coincidence. You mean that we found Rathma's book here and Lilith's going after him? My mother told me once there are no coincidences where immortals are involved. The passage was infested with demons too. I thought I heard something, but demons? How is that possible? It couldn't have been the Haradrim. They're secretive, but would never follow such a path. Oh, dude, that's so cool, Emery's. That you watched all the Skyrim streams in the in the past. I really want to go back and do like uh, the Mages Guild and Vampire Sound side of the Dawn Star Guild as well at some point. After Diablo, though. And then Starfield, I guess, after that. <laughs> so much stuff. Okay, so we're going to go to the Darkened Way next. This! This! Let's go, boys. I need more time. Grab this action. I'm not ready yet. Oh, there's loads of uh, yeah. oh, little chest. Right. It needs time Everything. to recharge. Soundtrack's nice. Very chill. I think some of the soundtracks are definitely better than others, though. Yeah. Oh yeah, give me that damage. I can't wait until this blow just gets to the point where we have unlimited energy. It's coming right up, boys. It's coming right up. So I think now we want to get enhanced shadow stat or discipline dash. So how close are we to this? Not close enough. I think Discipline Dash will get first, and then we'll get the Improved Shadow Step. So now we daze enemies who are already slowed, and we have this thing that slows enemies, and then we dash through them, and we daze them, and then we do tons of damage with our little uh, flying daggers. Just stacking all the debuffs and everything on them. Nothing they can do. I've gone the wrong way, guys. This is disgusting. Let's go back. I need more time. The yeet. Oh, I didn't do it. He's self conscious now. I need more time. Come on. No sound. More strangers in the camp. I'm not a stranger. I literally saved the town last time I was here. I'm not ready yet. I'll go back into this place now. I'm doing good though, man. Very well. Been uh, no life in Diablo the whole day so far. Wait, there's an amulet. What's this? Is it good? Level 5 amulet. 4.1 resistance to all elements. It's slightly better. What's this though? This is even better! This gives 72 armor. What's the plan? I'll explain on the way. Oh boy, this is not a good idea. YOLO, let's go. So many demons here. Oh! <laughs> 
deleted. Right, what's the fastest way down? Here. Mathma's description of the ritual was difficult to understand. And the notes weren't much better. I think I know how to talk with my mother again. Okay. We'll see how this goes for us. You guys think we should pay off or not? I'm not ready yet. The breeze coming from the Black Lake. Do you feel it? Let's hurry. Thanks for joining, Still C. Appreciate it, man. Just resurrect my mum. Give me a second. Mother? Mother, please. Can you hear me? My little magpie. It's you. I can save you from this, Mother. I promise. I can learn how to... Nere, stop. I can't be saved from my own mistakes. This body is only a husk. My spirit must pass on. And you must let me go. Mother, no. I need you. You need to move on, Magpie, without me. But I can help you one last time before I go. You have the divine blessing. Your blood is the necessary key. Nope. Oh god, I'm just committing fully. Full commit. Wow, okay. Hard committed there. She had to experience her mom dying twice. That's pretty hardcore. Joshua, thanks for joining the stream, man. Nairel. The way is open. We have to go. The way is shut. But... Do you think Lilith is even still here? It's been so long. I'm afraid she's won this one. Besides, I have to... Take care of my mother. <laughs> Play you fools. But it's not over yet. Not for you. Lilith was after Rosma. Find him. Learn why. I'll be back at the vault. All right. All righty ho. Oh, hello. Where what's going on? Oh, we walked my trail. She was here. Well, bloody well, hope so because I. I've gone through a lot of effort to get across that bloody bridge. Oh, look how creepy these things are. Look how... That's weird. Don't like that. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. Hello. You are the last visitor to my sanctum. Though... You come too late. Just as Lilith did before you. For it was my father... Inarius, who arrived here first. It unfolded as my visions foretold. What did your visions foretell? How we hurtled towards the prophecy's end. Okay. Speaking in riddles. I mean, look at this. No one likes to see this in the corner of their eye. It's just weird. Hello there, vampire man. What is this? It's useless. That's what it is. Get wrecked. Blue Ghost, a member for 24 months. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's brother. 
just joined the live stream, super excited, and headed back to the start. I understand. Thank you so much for joining me. Appreciate it, man. Always cool to have you here. I'm sorry for starting the stream so early. I understand that American wise it's not, not ideal. I'm not ready yet. This it started in dreams. I saw shattered images of the end of sanctuary. The scales of a great serpent carried these visions. And so I went to visit him. Oh. I and the serpent's thoughts met, and the fragmented future was mended together. I put it down in order, and the prophecy was born. Here's a giant pet snake. It's pretty cool. Are you done? Yeah, he's disappearing now. I don't want to miss the dialogue from the central chamber. We made it. I need to destroy the tumors to go any further. Done. Tumor deleted. Now we can pass inwards. He does sound pretty necromancery. Finally caught alive and I'm 35,000 feet in the air on a plane. Keep it up. <laughs> Sorry, that's jokes. Where are you flying to? <laughs> What's that? Uh, there's something over there. We need to go this way. Don't want to have to backtrack otherwise. Look at these weird, long looking things, man. I suppose there's another one down here as well. The prophecy became my burden. There were others that knew. Ones that couldn't understand the nature of such a thing. I knew Anarius would be driven to interfere, believing that it was about him. He saw himself as a savior, piercing hatred's heart in hell. Yep. Inarius has a massive evil <laughs> There you go. Say I was done with you today. Stop running away from me. Okay, so we got some new boots. Nice. I'm digging the green out though. 10 a.m. in Texas. Blow me. I'm not ready yet. Look at this blood, bloody river. Kind of looks weird when you stand in it, to be honest. Oh, we found a yes. unit. Now we can climb down. Probably do the other side yeah. of this room. We can't we go up more there. more time. So it must be this way. Oh yeah, we got to go around to get up there. We go up here, yes. So is it good? Yeah. So far, I'm really enjoying it. I'm kind of playing through, like, right now, at least the same section I play for at the beach. So I'm kind of excited to get past that and just experience, like, the rest of the game that I haven't played yet, you know? But yeah, great. Obviously enjoying it as much as I enjoy the beach. And, uh, glad that, so far at least, there's no pay-to-win aspect in the game that I can see. I'm not ready. So I locked the gates to hell. It was only a matter of time before Norris would discover what I'd done and come to the land with the key. Emerald. 
Go off first. Yeah, locking the gates to hell is a pretty good idea when you've got Inara sneaking around. There we go. Take care of this little Shima. You can climb on down. Got to get ready for surgery. Okay, pop it. Good luck in surgery. I hope you have a good recovery and I'll be streaming oh, tomorrow. You, you can chill out. To give me the key. You stand in the way of the savior. The holy blood in your veins should be boiled. Nothing you do will change the future I saw. I... I create my own destiny. And this prophecy of yours is just a small part of it. It is wider, beyond comprehension of ungrateful spawns like yourself. Oh dear, father-son relationship not going well. Yes. All you must understand is once I am victorious in hell, the high heavens will welcome me home, where I belong. He just wants to go home. I wish it would be true, Father. You done goofed up, though. Go out of this place. I'm being followed. Fulfilled his part of the prophecy. God lays on the horizon. Oh. Balance is sanctum. It's pretty dope. Please try Street Fighter 6 afterwards. Definitely love to play um, fighting games in my spare time. Oh, hello. Outsider. The oldest chamber has nothing but death and mourning. How fitting it shall be your grave. Let's see about that. Dude, why are you standing on the other side of the arena to me? Decimated. 
What did he drop though? First legendary pants. Let's go. Plus 13 strength. 1.2% dodge chance. While injured, your portions also res potion restore 10% resource. Dealing direct damage to dazed enemy with an agility skill grants stealth for 4 seconds? Oh, no, that's insane. Dude, that's really... F oh, that would actually be sick in PvP. That would be nuts. So... This applies slow. Then if you use dash, it dazes slowed enemies who are slowed for two seconds, which makes you invisible every single time. You could set that up constantly. The knight pentinant donning father's grace armor. Bribe. Nerel. Nerel. Is she safe? Yes. She is safe. <laughs> Our meeting is no coincidence. I came here to help. William, give this to her for me. I should never have taken it. He's so dark. I have repented. Do you think I was too late? No, not too late. The light has come to carry you home. Do you not see it, friend? Yes, yes, I see it now. They have come. Man. Put him in the punishment machine. God damn. You didn't need that armor to prove your worth, friend. Yeah, Jesus Christ. That lady's intense. But we got this legendary amulet, though. When hit while not healthy, a magical bubble defends you. I like it. Look at that, man. That was pretty intense. Oh, damn, let's carry on. Yes. Give me the key to hell. I will not ask again. You don't need to. I saw a vision of the key lifted from my corpse under the watchful eyes of the great serpent in my sanctum. If you are chosen as you say, it will come to pass. Hmm. It's basically like, Dad, you're gonna kill me. This it's is the sanctum. Where is she? She's not here. We missed her. This place is huge. There's murals of necromancers. Is that him? Is that Rathma? Damn, it's his body. This is the great snake. It's dead. We were too late. Inareth killed him, according to his visions. Let's have a look what we find out.
So yeah, and RF killed him to get the key to hell. His own son. I don't know if you would have chosen to stand beside me in this new world, Rathma. But I would have saved your place just the same. And now, all that you might have been has been stolen from me. After. Oh, there's a key to hell hidden inside it. Ah. This key unlocks more than the doors of hell. It unlocks our path to the future. A future made possible because of the price you paid. Absolute battle, brother. Yeah, this slap. Your sacrifice will not have been in vain. Yeah. He's melting into the floor. I love his snake rug. Look at that interlock snakes. Very cool. Speak with Nyrell. Okay, we're going. Yeah, that was sick. Yeah, the game is is good. I need more Enjoying time. It. For the story so far. Very excited to see where it goes next. Let's go and speak to Nyril. One dead boy. It needs time to recharge. It needs time to recharge. Sorry. I need more time. I'll give you time, you fool. Legendary pants, exactly. I'm not ready yet. Can't buy those for Primark. Mate, look at this mate. He's got to walk all the way time. out there. Why can't I just teleport back to the start? Can I do that? There's any way. I need more time. I'll be live streaming again tomorrow, do not fear. I might level up yes. even a bit later on and uh, then stream yes. again tomorrow where we can have even more bants. I need more time. I need more time. I need more time. He needs more time. Yeah, I've done videos about how to get Smithing level 100. If you also use the restoration potion grip uh, stuff to essentially boost your smithing skill by like 5,000%, and then you just smith one item, it immediately goes to 100. The Black Lake. Gah. Where is she anyway? Okay, she's over there. I thought I'd gone astray. Oh yeah, really enjoying the game so far. As I keep saying, I can I'll talk about it in a bit. Elaborate some more. It Don't worry about being late. It's all good. I will definitely be playing the new Elder Scrolls Online DLC. I need more time. Yeah. 
through here. These demons are just spawning consistently, aren't Back out of the mine. Yeah, I don't know where that is, to be honest. These skeletons are here every day. Alright, so now we can fast travel back here. Then we can go and speak with Nereal. Yes, I would like to travel. Yeah, I've not watched the full thing yet, but it was really cool to see the best sponsor him. I'm looking forward to playing yeah. through the, uh, the ESO chapter as well. The new Necrom stuff looks pretty decent. And they got back Wes Johnson, the original voice actor for Shergoreth, um, and Emeris Moray of Skyrim. You need more time. Big damage. What is this? This locked. I need one of those keys of this system, right? Let's go and find Neira. Here she is. Vigo wanted me to give this to you. Vigo wanted you to have this. Oh. He was a good man. And Lilith? Was she even there? Did you meet her? Already gone by the time I arrived. There is more. I can see that. Lilith took a key to hell off Rathma's body. Then it was all in vain. She's the only one who got what they wanted. Nairal. She came seeking the Haradrim of legend. Seeking hope. She found neither. But her part in things was far from over. Ooh, in truth, spoiled. we would need her more than she needed us. Didn't seem that way at the time, though. For anyone. Inarius proved to be just as unreliable as I'd feared. His self-obsession had driven him to murder his son, Rathma. And from the corpse left behind, Lilith had taken a key to hell. Where would she use it? We could only depend on ourselves to find out. Ah. We've leveled up again. A bunch of experience, actually. Uh, what do we want to go for? We want to upgrade Shadow Step. Actually, oh, we're one point away from that. I think so. Dash. Level are we? 17. Enhanced Shadow Step. Cooldown is reduced by three seconds when it damages an enemy you have not hit with Shadow Step in the last four seconds. It's pretty good. Um, enemies damaged by Shadow Step are stunned for two seconds. I think this is definitely better. I'm going to think about that though. Alright, let's have a look on the map here. So, we've done this area. 
in terms of the main quest. We've now got one, two, three possible places we can go to. And it levels with you at this point. So, like, you might have, like, a quest that's, like, level 20. But then once you get there and you're, like, level 25, it, the quest will be, like, level 25 as well. Because everything in the game, like, levels to you. So you can explore with your friends and stuff and not be out level, which I think is really clever. Uh, that's much more of a casual sort of fun way of doing it. Because then, like, say, for example, I've done... I've run through every area in this stream and done all the quests. Uh, I've, I've not done any of the side quests, though, and I've not done a lot of the cool content around here and collected anything yet. Um, so it's cool that I can still go back here and have some kind of challenge with the gameplay and killing enemies. I think that's fun. I think that's the best way of doing it instead of, like, out-leveling it, which some people I know prefer. So this is just, like, one zone, by the way. There's, like, another massive area over here and... The zones are huge, so, you know, we're going to go, I think, over here next stream, and we're going to go to Feral Nature. So, after the stream ends, it will take you over there, and you can go and check it out, but I've been streaming for, like, five hours now, so I'm going to go take a break, and then we're going to continue on with our main story side quest content tomorrow. Um, or maybe even later tonight, but probably tomorrow. I'll let you guys know. Thank you so much for watching, guys, though, and uh, drop a like on the video if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!